what is going on guys good morning and welcome to the resident evil breakfast stream i hope we are all doing very well uh like i say thank you for taking the time out uh, to come chill with us today hell yeah i'm just getting us all ready to go so we will get straight into the game guys hell yeah i'll give you guys a load down in a second unfortunately i've got like a I don't know, I, I don't know if I'm coming down with a little bit of the G-virus, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm kind of feeling a, a few viral symptoms right now, so um, it, it has been a little bit of a struggle. Um, <laughs> and I've got a double stream um, scheduled in today, I'm hoping to get on later, uh, so we can hopefully finish off Tomb Raider 2. Um, but yeah, this is the Resident Evil breakfast stream right now though. Um, and yeah, I am just wearing shades just to reduce the, the glare of the screen, that sort, because my head's a little sore. Um, it just makes it a, a bit more comfortable to the game with you know uh, but yeah i hope you guys are all good thank you for joining me uh, we are going to be playing as bobby kendo today in re2 so we're in his natural um his natural uh habitat basically um in in og re2 and uh, yeah we're going to be uh, cracking on with that um so yeah I, I love playing as bobby kendo i really do um so i thought we'll uh, we'll go with that um we'll go with our bobby kendo uh, so yeah, we're going to be playing uh, the the bio ram today as well, the Resident Evil randomizer. Um, I thought that'd be cool. Um, like I say, I always love shaking it up, especially on um, RE2 as well. Um, so yeah, we'll get us uh, started on that, guys. Hell yeah! Yeah, it should be all good across the platform. So thank you uh, for stopping in with us. That is a deep voice. That could definitely have been me when I woke up this morning. Boy, you're red. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. Gonna start straight into it. Everything is randomized. Okay, so bear with me a second. I'm just have to rebind the controls. Just give me a sec. Um. Let's go on this a sec. What's going on, Maggie and Dave? Good morning to you guys. Thanks for stopping in over on Tiki Top. We've got Miss Clown on YouTube. What's going on, Miss Clown? Hope you're all good. We've got DC23. Said, howdy, howdy, you absolute legend. Bruh, I, I don't see a legend. <laughs> Thank you, my dude. You guys are too kind to me. Hell yeah. There we go. Uh-oh. What we got anyway? Okay, so we got the uh, the bow gun, some bow rounds, magnum magnum bullets. Okay. Okay. That's not a bad start for the bow round. Oh, whoa, whoa. Stand with the mods right off the bat. Vomitex, thank you for dropping the rose for us, my mate. Appreciate you, man. Thank you. That's right, we are all RPD'd up this morning. Go to the other house and see if I can find any clues. I thought you were one of them. Okay, let's separate again. Yes, you're here too? I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Ah, talking to yourself? She calling Kendo a madman? Talking to yourself? No, bro was warning you. So let me just do something. There we go. Lovely. Just need to add something in there. Hell yeah. Let's have a look. There's a bloody wire on here. There we go. Right, it's got a couple of slots free. That's good. Okay, fuel. Um, grab that. Oh no, it is a brutal end to Jillian. We've literally just started the randomizer, man. Jillian's already gone. What's going on, Goose? Good morning to you, bro. Hope you're well. We could do with uh, seeing what Jillian's got on her, I think. Oh! Is this going to work? Yeah! Get off! I need to... Oh my god, this is a bad start. This is bad. 
That's all I needed to do. I need to see what Jillian had. All that for a freaking blue herb. Okay. Okay. I did try. I did try and avoid them. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Kind of pressed things a bit too quick there. There we go. <laughs> that coffee rush, though. <laughs> What's going on, Psycho? I know, right? Jill in a freaking OG Stars uniform. Come on. Glad we've seen a bit of Jillian this morning. Thank you, Goose, for dropping the rose for us, my mate. Thank you very much. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Okay. That's the grenade launch. I think I'm going to have to get rid of something. Uh, let me get rid of that fuel. Oh, hang on. Sorry, guys, it's got to be done. Let me just go that, do that to a uh, empty slot. I'm gonna have to. That's it. Can't miss out on getting that right. Awesome. These crows ain't loyal. We've got crows as well get past those but yeah how's, how's your weekend been guys hope you've had an awesome time hope it has been wicked for yourselves it is great to be back on with you this morning come on i see those little um crawly things from from the willy b boss there's, a, there's another blue head there another one i'll leave that there. okay They annoying as hell, right? They'd be annoying as hell. What's going on there? Halfway gamer dude, good morning to yourself. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <gasps> no! Oh man. <laughs> Stuck amongst all those nemmies! Bruh! They're out in full force. Bro. thought he was looking at something. Let me just back it up. Nice. Nicely dealt with. That's not too bad with the bow, but they're the mutated lickers as well. Jeez. I know, right? Steve freaking five nemmies. Thank you, Liam. Appreciate that, man. I love being all RPD job. I, I love repping the merch. Like, not only for Resi, but any games we play, really. I was trying to dress accordingly with the game, you know. Oh, well, bro, you you can you can chill and vibe there. <laughs> What's going on, Ted? And uh, Tom, welcome on in, man. I know, right? <laughs> Fucking hands, get off his feetses. Get off the Kendo's Timberlands. He, he will not be happy. Keep off the Timbs. Yeah, safe to say that, Stephen. Kendo's life flashed before his eyes. But of course, we always overcome the odds. Always. Alright, so if we head in... Right, so the card key's there. Because obviously, usually the... Um, usually, the, obviously, uh, Marvin, or I, the character in that room, they usually give us the card key. Um, so but we do kind of need to activate that so we can then get in the other rooms. So hopefully, we're not meant to unlock this yet, but hopefully we can unlock this and kind of not crash the game. So we're kind of unlocking it when, before we're actually meant to. So we'll do that. I love the, um, I, I love this music right now as well. Cheeky Ari one music as well, innit? Hey, thank you, Deluxe Retro Gaming. Raiden is already on Twitch right off the bat. Come on, welcome on in, man. And uh, all the Raiders, thank you guys for stopping on in with us. We've literally just started um, original Resident Evil 2 by around with Bobby Kendo. So kick back and enjoy with us, guys. Enjoy the chaos and the randomness that is by around. Whoa, what is it? Oh. It's OG Chris. Kill me. What's the matter? This is huge. Hold on. <laughs> now, the worst possible situation has occurred. 
The failure of the experiment created a virus, a biological weapon, polluting the entire lab. I see. Well, it's not your fault. This place is crazy. If we stay here, all of us will end up dead. Oh, of course not. You were pretty worried, though, weren't you? Hey, we're partners, aren't we? Let's work together. Wait here. I'll save you. Hold on. Here's the serum. Is he all right? It must be a star's radio. It's a little bit broken, but it might still be usable. I'll take it with me. But don't you worry, girly. You'll be safe in here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. Yeah, let's take a look. <laughs> Who are you? What are you doing here? Ooh, sorry about that, babe. You really hit him with the babe twice. <laughs> Don't you worry, girly. Then he pulls an RPG out on him. Do not call Chrissy Redfield, girly. He will not be happy with you. Oh, man, he absolutely went there. <laughs> I love that. Uh, yes, Liam, I am aiming to be back on tonight. Um, I'm feeling a little bit rough. I, th I don't know if I'm coming down with the G virus a little bit. Oh, my God, no. Not will he be in the safe room. Hell no. Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm not like actually feeling kind of 100%, but I'm hope, hoping to um, st still be on tonight over on uh, Tomb Raider tonight. Hopefully we can uh, maybe finish that off uh, back on Tomb Raider 2 tonight. Uh, Kirsty, good morning to you. I'm, I'm doing good, thank you. Uh, yeah, apart from, apart from, like I say, just feeling uh, not quite 100%. Um, like I say, my, my head's a little sore as well. Um, but obviously, I still really wanted to stream. Um, so that's why I'm wearing the, these little shades, that's all, because they, they just take the glare off the screen a little bit, so they're a little easier on my eyes. Um, so that's why I'm, I'm currently wearing these. Just nice nice and easy to uh, vibe in. But yeah, awesome to catch you as well, Kirsty. Welcome on in. Stop in and vibe with us. Come on. Let's pop this uh, away for now. I'm going to try not to use this, really. Um, I'll just put the bullets there. Try and just go go easy on them. Oh, thank you, Zan. Thank you, my sweet, for pinning the comment. Appreciate you. Thanking you. <laughs> You've been buzzing for some Tomb Raider, Liam. I'm going to have a cheeky break after I finish Tomb Raider 2. I might maybe do, obviously, a little bit of 3. But, um, yeah, man, it, it, you've got to understand, man, it fries my brain. It is, a, it is a hell of a lot to take on. The OG Tomb Raider. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, let's get past. As if Willie B's just chilling and vibing in there. Hell nah. Hell nah. I think 2 Raider 3 is a lot better than the second. Apparently it's a, a very dark game as well. Like literally, it's very dark on the screen, right? Yeah, apparently it's very dark and the difficulty is ramped up even, even more, right? <gasps> Holy sh... What? Um... Okay, we, we actually don't need to be in there till we have the lighter, you know. Because we have to light the fireplace, don't we? You know the whole sacrifice to the hellfire? Relight my fire. Joey said, who's your favourite Resident Evil character? It's definitely Leon Kennedy. He's my favourite video game character of all time. Absolutely love um, Leon Kennedy. But yeah, I also love Bobby Kendo. So I, I've chosen to play as Kendo uh, this morning for our randomizer. Oh. Oh, that hits in this, doesn't it? Come on. Thank you guys for coming in with all the likes and shares of the stream. 
Massively appreciated. It helps us out uh, in the algorithm, so thank you for that. You got your glass on as well, Miss Clown. Come on. Hell yeah. I'm just quite into wearing these right now because um, they just help reduce the glare, that's all. So it, it just helps. My head's a little sore, that's all. Right, let's put the key items a little more up there. Hey, what's going on, Metal Macy? Good morning, legend. Thank you. You guys are too kind to me. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing good, thank you, man. I said, just not quite 100% at the minute. Like I said, I think I'm coming down with a bit of the G virus, but it's fine. It is fine. We move, man. We move. We power on, you know? We all good. Might go use that diamond key right now. Thank you, Liam, for the diamond. Sean, where, where's the Ada Wong gang at? <laughs> Sean's looking for the, the Ada Wong fans. We may end up seeing her. I can't guarantee, but we, we are playing randomizer. So she may turn up. She may not. Mm. Ooh. Is that a... They're the hands in the floor. Aren't they? Get off. Get I told you guys, get off Kendo's Tim's. He will not be happy. Oh, hell yeah. I've actually got the special key for the uh, the alternate costumes. It'd be so good if he could wear them. But unfortunately, I don't think he can, though. So we'll just go and um, deposit a few items. Yeah, you, you love a little bit of Ada as well, don't you, Zamp? Come on. Ada Schlong. <laughs> you know what? I kind of don't mind her in a way. I, I don't mind her. I do love the good guys, though. She does lay on dirty, doesn't she? But, yeah. There's something about them, though, right? Oh, nice. We've got the shotty to hottie from that, so I'm happy with that. Come on. It's, it'd be so good if Kendo squeezed on that Made in Heaven jacket. That'd be so good. Right, I'll pop that to one side as well. Pop that there. Uh, let's let's reload that shotgun on. So I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll put that Magnum back as well, I think. I think we should be fine. We haven't got flame rounds, have we? Because we could use that, really, I'll do with it um, for the ivies. You know all those plants in there? Uh, let me just decide what we'll bring. So we'll take that, we'll take that. Um, that should be fine. It's difficult with Byrag. You, you've kind of you've got to try and bring the bare minimum if you can. So we'll go do that next room and then I'll save it. I think you've got to try and like kind of bring the bare minimum so you can pick up loads. Um, you know, as you're uh, vibing around, you know. Yeah, I get you on that, Sam. It's, it's actually quite interesting that. Villains over heroes, better law. They, they actually do. Get off his tims. It, it is interesting because um, sometimes the villains, they're actually not that bad of people. They're actually kind of not, not that bad because, uh, you know, sometimes it's like the life events and things like that that have made them. Oh, sorry, I hit something. That have made them like how they are or they have like good reasons for being the way they are. Yeah, it is a good way to see that. For sure. Oh, are we going to take out Chrissy? Whoa. What, is it? <laughs> Whoa. what is it? I'm sorry, Chrissy. Man, we had to act fast there. Yeah, this guy's Bobby Kendo. This guy. The gun shop owner. He's actually called Robert Kendo, but I always call him Bobby Kendo. Lovely. Lovely. We ain't doing too bad. Let's head upstairs. Go to the uh, cheeky stars office and tea. Yeah, I, I love playing as Hunk Joey. Hunk's cool. 
I would love to see more of Hung, like more of his backstory, like or like a campaign sort of thing, centering around him, you know. Oh man, that hits every time. Right, we've got a lot of things, but th these are like for later on. <laughs> it's a lot of things for like later. We'll keep those up there. Um... Just make a little cheeky save. He is and he done. Kendo's so fine though. He's wicked, in a. I think we'll see Carlos again in future games. I don't think they'd really concentrate much on Carlos, if I'm honest. Because obviously, he was the last game he was in was obviously um, RE3 Remake. Um, I'm not a, a huge fan of him in that, though. I like uh, the original Carlos. You know, as kind of controversial as he can be, sleazy as he can be. I, I, I think he's awesome, man. I actually think he's more sleazy in the remake. I don't really, um, not really a fan. He just like won't leave Jill alone, you know? Cause like she, she kind of bats him off like, you know, as if to say like, you know, I don't need no man, I, I can look after myself and tea, you know? But he's probably just like, you know, you can tell he admires her and stuff like that. And cause he's kind of always like, oh, hey, supercar, supercar and all that. And it's just like, just, it's fine. She's got this Carlos, so you, you can chill. I, I think, like, obviously he kind of means well, but it's like, yeah, you know. He kind of means well, but it's like, you know. It's fine, Carlos. <laughs> Jill's already been through Ari 1, you know. Like, she got this. She got Ari 3. Alpha Emma, thank you for the follow. Is it, like, glitching or something? It's unfollowing. Well, hopefully you stay followed this time. Hopefully, Emma. I'm not sure what's going on there. Might the, might be the platform glitching or something. Uh, good morning, Danny. What's going on, Vincent? Hope you guys are all good. Thank you as well for the follow, Vincent. Thank you, guys. Uh-oh. I don't even want to know what that is. At the end of the corridor. I think it's like some kind of bossy boss. Nice, got a cheeky handgun. Let's go check the... Uh... You can never go past without looking at the star's picture. Hey, let's go, Goose. Thank you very much for that massive diamond, my mate. Thank you. Appreciate you. Thank you very much for that, man. Always appreciate you guys. Phenomenal support. Thank you for turning up this morning with us. Nice. Sounds like they're good, obedient boys and girls. Oh. <sighs> Sorry about that. Freeze. Here she is. Come on. Do you know when she came into the stream? Oh, so obedient boys and girls. Come on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. That woman was... I have to talk to her. But you should be safe inside here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. Who are you? What are you doing here? <laughs> Think of all the paperwork I would have to fill out if you were to show up alive. <gasps> wow. Ada filling out paperwork? Hell no, that, that is... She, that is like, she's beyond that. It's below her, right? Scout Rose, thank you for sending over the roses. Thank you for the follow as well. Thank you very much. Uh, we can need to be past there. Um, we need the spade key first, though. 
So it's fine, we'll, we'll go back. <laughs> we go have to go back, I think. <laughs> and thank you, Goose, again for the diamond, my mate. Thank you very much. Dave Repairs, awesome to see ya. Thanks for stopping in with us, mate. I hope you're all good. Alright, let's drop off a couple of things at the uh, this little save room. That's it, we got another Dave in Goose. He's over on the YouTube chat. Dave Repairs. We all know some decent Daves, don't we? I'd say we all know a Dave, but I, I know loads of Daves. We all know some decent Daves, don't we? I won't take the handgun with us right now because we haven't actually got like any ammo for it. We might find some on the way though. So I will, I'll keep that there. Um, pop these with the herbs and ting. Um, and that should be about about it, I think. Uh, probably take that with us. Take the, uh, yeah. That should be okay. Let's see how we manage with that. Um, oh, I'm thinking we, we could do with taking out those ivy plants in that room, you know. Tell you what, should we go clear out that ivy plant room? We'll take that, we'll take a blue herb. We've got to be courageous, guys. There might be something in there that we need. Don't have flame rounds, but grenade rounds might be good. I think we could maybe use a couple of them, you know, just to clear them out. Just to clear out the first couple, because it's like a one-shot kill. And then we'll just get past. Let's go take a look. It's hilarious how chaotic the rooms can be because, you know, there's there's multiple enemies. Um, you know, like ones like the ivy plant stuff and like they should not be there, you know what I mean? Like there's limited space, they're not designed to be there. Right, I've got to do is right off the bat. Bang. Bang. That's two down. There we go. There we go, just needed those. Come on, come on. All for a damn ink ribbon. I don't think... Um... Shit, we still need the... Uh... We do still need the... Ah! Get off! I don't want a hog. Let's just get rid of it. Hopefully they don't... Oh, shit. Oh, that was a bad decision, I think, you know, guys. I think that was a bad decision. Ah, oh, that was a bad call by me. That was a bad call. I think we need to reload that. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not happy with that decision. We'll have to wait until we... Uh, at least we know like the lighter isn't in there. You know what I mean? Let me just do that again. That's my bad. Thank you, Coos, mate. Thank you for the death rose. Appreciate you, man. Oh, do I need to... Um... Just give me a second. I think I need to sort the controls again. There we go. So we'll go do that. Um... Right, I've just got to pop and do the stars room again. Then we're good. had a freaking fab weekend was you guys up to anything or was you working or anything let us know what you was up to I'm going to, to make you work it this morning, man. I bet Kendo... I wonder if Kendo... I was going to say, does he go to the gym, you know, before he starts his shift in, in the shop? 
in his gun shop every day. But I think he's the type to have a home gym. Don't you reckon he has like a home gym in his uh, garage? <laughs> Hell yeah, Goose. Played a bit of Tomb Raider 2. Hell yeah, man. Sorry, I knocked something there. We've actually got um, three levels left of Tomb Raider 2. Can we finish it tonight? Potentially, with your guys' help. I think we could do. I can't remember if I searched the desk in the last one. Oh yeah, there we go. Sounds like they're good, obedient boys and girls. Oh. Sorry about that. Freeze! That was such a wicked entrance out there, wasn't it? Sounds like they're such obedient boys and girls. What a little entrance by Ada Schlong on our buy around this morning. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. That woman was... I have to talk to her. But you should be safe inside here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. Who are you? What are you doing here? Right, so we ain't going in that plant room right now. Um, we won't go back till we have the, the lighter to do that little puzzle, you know, set the, uh, set the fireplace on fire. explore i think we can go now right we'll go take this uh yeah go take the diamond key with us now come on yeah it is so good uh domino it's so good man to en enjoy your uh, it, it keeps the, the experience like so fresh like playing with, with the byron so good man And it's just, it's, as you'll see in some rooms, it's absolute freaking chaos. Pure chaos on here. Uh, do I want anything else to pick up on there? Well, so that's good. So we're done in that room. So we'll go in this other uh, hallway. bring any help from us i don't think freaking nemi galore in that hallway hell no nah. right we are on caution okay it's fine we can sort this <laughs> that was a mad surprise wasn't it right <laughs> oh damn what we got near Oh man, Vomitex, thank you very much for dropping those roses, my mate. And I'll drop a cheeky rose jam now to thank you guys. Now we're in a place of safety. For the roses this morning, thank you very much. Let's go. What's going on, Nadine? Welcome on in. Said a total nostalgia. It is right. It's always a vibe. Always. Nice. That's what we needed. That's what Kendo ordered. Is there another one? Oof. Thank you, Domino, for the follow, mate. Uh... 
See what else is around here. I don't think we can access the... Oh, shit! Fucking hell. No. <laughs> we can't go up to the, the upper bit anyway, because we've got to get there. Like, we're going to have to get there, because you, you can uh, unlock the door from this outside. <gasps> oh, damn. Right, so we do need to kind of go use that. Um, oh, man, I am... <laughs> so scared right now. Right, let's just get out of here quick. I need to go back to a box. Just give me a sec. But will he be in here? There is literally, there is no chill anywhere. The fact that they turn up in save rooms as well. Come on. <laughs> oh, we can use that actually. Let's just get past Willy B. Need him like right round here. Over here, bro. Right round here. Come on. Oh, nice. Got a cheeky rocket launcher. Come on. Probably need that for a little bit later on. So we'll, we'll, we'll save that. Um, put a light there. Got to go make a quick cheeky save. And then hopefully we can uh, get past those nebbies. Yeah, we are going to have to go back down that corridor anyway, like, later on in the game. You know, when we get the club key, we're going to need to anyway. But, yeah, there's kind of nowhere else for us to go right now apart from, um... Apart from there, to, you know, to unlock that, that diamond key room. So we are going to have to head down there. We just make a little more space. Just a little more. So we'll use that. Um, just pop that away a sec. I might maybe just put the the bow gun away. Just oh, I can't. I can't even put that. It's fine. I'll put the shotty tight away. See how we, we manage with that. Right. See if we can get the get past the freaking nemes. Stop! They are so fast. Oh man, they are so fast. <laughs> we get there on caution. Yeah, I'll take that. <laughs> nice. That's a diamond key used. Let's see what that is. It'll be fine. I don't think we, we get any items if we develop the film reel. I don't think so. I might take it with us anyway. Because we're going we're gonna to need to go back there. It might be worth seeing if it does give us anything. I don't know if it will just give us the actual document that you get, you know. Uh, Logan, thank you for the follow. Thank you guys for stopping on in with us. still comes through if we get this oh we're good we're good nice oh oh it's a hunter in there oh hell no one of them hunter gammas hell no thank you for the follow angel perez says love the sweater thank you man appreciate that thank you very much i, I freaking love repping the rpd you know <gasps> Hell no. We can't do anything anyway in here because um need the uh, need the lighter again. Um I mean we could. I don't know if there might be something on that desk. Oh no, I don't want to leave it. 
Should we get him? Should we take him out? Let's try to take him out. What's going on, Lewis? Great to see you, mate. Shit. Oh, we are in danger. Hell no. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Okay, that's fine. I just need to get in there to see what that was. <gasps> that was close. He was almost a not kendo sandwich, but I mean, this is the breakfast uh, show, innit? He was almost a, a kendo, you know, a, a, a bacon butter, you know, with, with sliced kendo in it. <laughs> right, just get out of this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, kendo, get up, please. Ow. Let's see what that is. Oh, oh it's a bloody flamethrower as well. <laughs> right, okay. Ow. It's fine. Let's get out of here. I'm trying to actually think if there's like anything we can do. There's kind of not much we can do right now. Like we need the spade key. We need the emblem. Um... There's some key items that we have just not got yet, so we're a little bit stuck at the minute. Not got the heart key. Can't really advance to any more areas, um, unless this gives us something. So yeah, just bear with me, guys. If not, I might have to maybe just spawn in a key just so we can get somewhere. Um, yeah. Have a look. We've got lots of key items, but they are for like later in the game, though. Can't even use that at the minute. Used it on that other door. Um, unless I spawn in the lighter, maybe. Maybe we could do that. Um, yeah, see so if we can leg it to that save room. Thank you guys, thank you to Belle and Lewis for coming in with all those roses. Thanks for your support, guys. Appreciating you. Thank you very much. Appreciate you guys. Yeah, Nemi almost made Kendo into a cheeky fry up, didn't he? <laughs> Sliced him for a cheeky full English brekkie. Come on. Yeah, obviously, this is a spade key, this is, and so is upstairs. Hmm. So to play the randomizer, if, if you just Google BioRand, I think it's called BioRand.net. I think that's the, the, the site. That's where everything is, like to download and get this up and running. It's, it's PC only, but yeah, everything is on there. And Baba, thank you for the follow. It is indeed wizard. Yeah, yeah, we still got some locked areas, so we're a little bit stuck at the minute. Just got to figure something out. This is hitting on in the save room though, isn't it? man hey what's going on becca good morning to you uh so just come off playing re1 remastered you love your resi one don't you hell yeah um bought the third one also hell yeah which one's that the re3 remaster hell yeah i know there's like a huge resident evil sale on steam right now i'm not sure about consoles but i know it's on steam just bro i just used a green herb and it hadn't even took us off caution it's, it's done us dirty there it's done us dirty um, I'm just trying to think. There's kind of nothing else we can do right now, guys. I think the only thing I can kind of do for us, um, the genuinely isn't any other areas. So all I could do is potentially, should we spawn in the lighter so we can do... Uh, do a couple of the puzzles and see if it gives us the keys. Should we maybe go do that? I think that's what I'm going to have to do for us. So yeah, just, just bear with me a sec. I'm going to have to. What am I doing on that for? There we go, just need inventory. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna have to, have to get that cheeky lighter. Cool. And I don't mean to, you know, I don't mean to, to kind of cheat or anything, but we're, we're going to need like a first aid as well. I just want to make us good and then just head out with, with a first aid as well. So we'll get all good with that. Cheeky save. Uh, we're gonna have to take out those ivy plants, aren't we? So we'll, we'll take that with us as well. I know, imagine looks. It'd be just our luck, wouldn't it? <laughs> Good morning, Jamie. Great to see you, man. Nice. God, you've got them all, Becca. Like, like, say you've got to, um, you know, try and get them if you can, aren't you? You know, if, if they get in the sale, gotta be done. Um, I actually need um, I need the RE remasters. I need those for PC and there is a sale on Steam so literally after this stream I think I'm going to have to uh, purchase those get them downloaded because if I can get them for PC then I can add some mods onto them and stuff for us we can you know we can mod Mr. X and Ting you know X go and give to you we can mod him as um, what Th Thomas the Tank Engine uh, we can mod him as Pennywise yeah we, we can do, do things like that you know have some fun with the uh with the remakes the, have you heard of the re1 remake um mod it's uh, like a werewolf mod i think you can make chris a werewolf or something you can you can play if you're playing as chris you can mod him as like a werewolf or something <laughs> right get out of the way get out of the way i mean it are you kidding did that not even what you took a magnum shot then you tried to give kendo a hug bro why won't you die damn it's where we proper need the flame rounds for this damn hey awesome to see you tyler said it works so can't stay but i dropped a cheeky like thank you thanks for stopping by with us uh, on the stream hell yeah we will have a good one indeed my mate thank you very much get off Right, let's go, Bobby. Oh, shit. <laughs> no! I was just choked then. Just have a bit of coffee. I almost just kind of choked. Because it took me by surprise so much. I'm going to have to take that. Get out of the way! <laughs> Jeez, I don't think there's anything else in there. So at least we can say we've checked that one. What's going on, Han? Great to see ya. Hope you're all good. Oh, this is rough. <laughs> We've got a, a little bit of a rough buy round right now. But uh, yeah, we're we doing all right. We all right. <laughs> yeah, it's the only thing, Becca, about RE3 Remake. I just think, you know... I don't know if I find more annoying. I don't know if I find maybe Mr. X a bit more annoying in RE2 Remake. Just how he's always hovering. He's like always there. That that really annoys me. But yeah, with Nemi in RE3, you kind of know when he's going to turn up pretty much. Um, that's good. I think I cleared the liquor. Oh, I think there's like one liquor left in that room, actually. You eat the good herb. There we go, Kendo. There we go. Um, we need to go use this lighter in that other club key room. Uh, yes, Hannah, I do plan on streaming this evening. I should be able to push through. I'm, I'm feeling like not quite 100% at the minute, but um, I think I, I can pretty much push through. Because uh, I do, do want to do a double stream tonight. Um, so, yeah, hoping to jump back on Tomb Raider 2 this evening. It'll be like usual time, kind of 8 to 9 p.m. UK time. Oh, my God. so fast yeah i'm hoping to finish up tomb raider 2 tonight so we've got the last three levels do you think they're very long we've got three levels left so it would be awesome to uh, finish that up tonight Thank you. 
think I'm gonna have to get in a couple of cheeky first aids, guys, because there is a liquor in here. If that swings at us, we're, we're gone. This is a bit brutal, this one. There we go, just get them in. Temple of Sian. Um, thank you, Paige, for the follow. Appreciate ya. <gasps> How are these not killing him in, like, one shot? Is there another one? Another one. Another one. Fuck. That was a panic shot. Nice. Yeah, have we seen Temple of Xi'an can be a peg the rest of very short. Think you'll finish it in one stream. I will give it a decent go tonight. I think it would be cool to finish it off and then we can um, have a little vibe on Tomb Raider 3 um, on the stream after. I just need to get cracking. Like, I probably need to get cracking with it because I've got to finish off The Last of Us um, Part 2 Remastered as well. We've also got that gameplay on the go. We've also got... Um, yeah, later this month, uh, Alone in the Dark releases as well. So, obviously, I'd like to play that on launch. And then, also, not horror-related, but uh, we've got South Park Snow Day coming out as well. I think that's, like, right at the end of the month. Um, so, I would love to um, would love to stream that with you guys, if you're up for that. It's a, it's a bit of a fun, fun stream, fun game on the go, you know. So, yeah, a couple of releases this month I'm really looking forward to. What's going on, Paddy boy? Great to see you, mate. Ow! Get! Get off. I'm sorry, Barbie. I'm sorry. Ow! Oh, I can't even pick up the... Uh... Fuck. Oh, that's the flamethrower in that corner. I want to pick it up, and I can't. <laughs> I can't pick it up. Bruh. Right, I think what I'm going to have to do, guys, I'm going to have to spawn in the um, the spade key because I, I don't know where it is, unfortunately. It's just not popping for us. So I'm going to have to spawn that in. This is a bit of a rough buy run, this. <laughs> it's a bit rough. I do try and refrain from, obviously, spawning things, and I try and play it kind of genuinely, but sometimes if I literally cannot make progress, I need to spawn things into the game. If you get that, you know what I mean? Um, right, so what we'll do... Um, get the shotty to hotty. We'll get those in. Yeah, that'll do, really. Um, let's get past bro. Will be. Yeah, sorry, Paige, what was she saying? Um, this in the first game made me afraid of zombies for life. <laughs> for real, seven years old, sleep with a box over my head in case a zombie was around. I was protected. Yeah, they wouldn't be able to, like, mun munch your head off then, would they? <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to surrender, I think, guys, and get in, uh, get the spade key for us. to do that so we can just unlock those couple of rooms see what's in there you know yeah it's an absolute bargain it is wizard the cheeky resi steam sale yeah definitely get on that guys you know if you have the means if you're able it's a great way of getting the games right and uh, yeah that, that's what appeals to me as well like say i've already got them for consoles but um if i get them on pc it allows me to like add mods to them so then, you know, when we stream the remakes in future, it's not just the standard games. We can change them up with mods, you know. Some real entertaining ones as well. You know, mod modding in, um, you know, Mr. X um, in his alternate forms, you know. I love the Pennywise Mr. X. What's going on, Seppi? So I've got one achievement left in RE2 Remake, but it's, what's that, shop mission? And it sucks. 
What are you going to do for that achievement, Seppi? Yeah, I must admit, I'm not like actually a massive uh, achievement hunter, you know. I'll only kind of do them if they seem fun, you know what I mean? <laughs> um, yeah, there is a way of... Um, it's if you play... If you guys have had the emulator Duck Station. I think it's I think it's with Duck Station. Or is it with... Uh, I think it is. If you play like the OG um, RE1 games with that, um, you can uh, you can basically kind of install a bit of a pack where like you can unlock achievements on it. So it just like it's really cool because it can like just encourage you to play the game in a different way as to how you normally play it. Do you know what I mean? I think it'd be really cool. Um, so yeah, I've, I've actually done a couple of streams where we've unlocked some achievements, but there's, there's hell of loads more achievements left though. Um, Right, so, have I put that spade key away? Where's it gone? I'm confused, we need that for upstairs. I don't know where it's gone, let me just spawn it in again. I'll tell you what is real satisfying as well. Um, my controller. I got a new controller at the weekend. Um, so yeah, it's, it's real awesome. Like, it's just it's just a real awesome like Xbox um, kind of PC sort of controller. And it saves me from you know going and raiding my Xbox from downstairs and disconnect it and then bringing it back up here. That you know the controller and stuff. So now I've got like a designated PC controller. It's really cool. So when I'm um, flicking through those options, you know, to spawn things into the inventory. Um, it's actually, it's not like noisy or anything, like on a standard Xbox control, it's, it's real soft and uh, like silent as I'm scrolling through it. It's the little things, man. I appreciate the little things, you know. But yes, yeah, a solid controller though. So yeah, I've got that whole new controller vibe right now. Oh, I forgot we need to take bro out, don't we? So he said the mission where you have to survive and is that kill hundred zombies in a small shop as the police officer? Oh, is that on the is it like on one of the extra missions or something like the Fort Survivor missions maybe? Not really played those Seppi, so I'm not sure. Uh, Top Boy ninety three, what's going on, man? How do I use game points? I've got hundreds to give you because you're really good. Bless you, man. Thank you. I believe you. Um, if you wish to gift, I think you can. Obviously, in in the um. In the means of, of diamonds over on um tiktok there should be an option i think it's maybe down the bottom of the screen there's a little like parcel like a little gift thing that's how you can gift those but yeah thank you man i appreciate that thank you very much i really want to use the rocket launch i think i might have to use the uh i'm about to use the magnum on bro i think Who's the Magnum on him? Yeah, sorry guys, this is a little bit of a... Feels like a bit of a slow burn of this randomizer, so I'm sorry. It's taken me a while to, to get shit done. <laughs> Gareth said, oh my god, I want a full English breakfast now. It is pretty contagious, isn't it, right? Whenever I do these full English breakfast streams, it's just the name of the, yeah, the, the show. The Resident Evil full English bracky show. Um... It gets me in the mood of wanting a full English brekkie, but I never have time to, though. It's always like a quick brekkie and get on stream. So, yeah, loads of people always ask, the like, have you had a full English this morning? It's like, no, definitely not, man. <laughs> get out the way. Nice. <laughs> Bobby Kendo with the, them little uh, crawly thingies is like, get off the Levi's. Bro, he worked really hard for those Levi jeans. <laughs> hey, Franny the Zombie Maid, uh, thank you for the follow. Thank you, Becca, for the diamond, my sweet. Appreciate ya. Um, Seppi said, want to play the OG RE games, but the tank controls keep me from it. Yeah, I get you, man. They're not for everyone. Um... The only reason, I, I don't know if I'd potentially struggle if I came came to this a bit, kind of maybe later on 
you know, later on in life sort of thing. Um, but I, I've literally played these from a very young age. I, I, I probably I, I would have been about five or six or something uh, when my dad introduced me to these. So it's literally all I, I've known uh, Resident Evil to be. You know, up until like Resident Evil 4 was released, and obviously it, it created that different. Whoa. <laughs> Oh god, it created that different kind of direction of um, obviously where the games were heading, the play styles, etc. Um, I think what we could do, um, yeah. Bad. How am I going to get to do this puzzle with ease in here? I don't think I'm going to be able to. <laughs> I'm about to go get some firepower, I think. I can't even drop down! Get off! No! You didn't even let bro land! Right, we're gonna have to take these out. Fuck. Oh God. Thank you, uh, OSJ and Ruben, for the follows. Thank you, guys. Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna have to come back with some firepower. Um, and we do actually have the, um, we can do some things at this side of the hall now we're up here. We've got the, we've got the crank and the cog wheel so we can progress obviously, you know, a bit further than the, the library. But we also do have the, the jewels so we can go place the tiddy jewels. Let it ride, thank you for the follow. I've included the game name on the screen on TikTok and it obviously says it's a randomizer as well. So I've included it over there so you guys can see. Thank you, Anna, for the follow. Thanks so much for all you guys coming in. Um, I can't believe we've got a save room. That's actually safe. Uh, Cal, thank you for dropping the roses. Very kindly for us, my mate. He's got the rose jam on. Thank you. Especially for tea. Thank you for the follow. Thanks, guys. Appreciate you. Thanks so much. And Che as well. Thank you. But yeah, I'm loving, loving the RE4 vibes as well. Loving the, the little save music from uh, RE4 in here. Come on. On the by rounds, you literally hardly ever see actually any zombies, do you? <laughs> I might put this back just for now. Um, I, th I feel like we've got enough handgun bullets to, to warrant taking the handgun, so we'll, we'll take that. We're not getting literally any green herbs or first aids. It's literally all green and... Um, sorry. Blue and red herbs, which we can't do much with. Not right now. Um, let me just sort this out a sec. I want it, I want the thing to look better. There we go, that's that. We can go place those jewels. We'll make a little save while we're in here as well. Thank you, Paige. Appreciate you. Thanks for dropping all those likes and thank you, everyone. Um, across the platforms to the likes and shares the stream it generally helps us in the algorithm uh, so thank you very much helps us bring new people in as well growing the whole squad with every stream now you you guys always give me phenomenal support and I, honestly i could not be more grateful for you guys so thank you for that yeah leon loves his matilda doesn't he che <gasps> This is bad coming here in caution. This is bad. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, I thought we was gonna be out. Damn it. Kendo, okay, no, this isn't the time to check it. Stop. <laughs> I think we're good. Oh, no, we're not. <laughs> that has got us on danger, but I'm, I'm pretty I'm pretty proud of us that we've, we've taken those out, though. Stepped out there on caution. I've just realised we need to put the... Um, need to put that fire out, don't we? Like I say, guys, I'm going to have to spawn in a cheeky first aid. Or else there's nothing else I can do, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Needs must and all that. Um, so yeah, let's get a little um, get a little respect to Bobby Candle. 
I love that song. Give a little respect to me. I never actually heard that until um, Waitus did a cover of that. They do a sick cover of that song. I'm so in love with Kendo. <laughs> He opens his gun shop in RE2 and lets us in. Get a little respect to Bobby Kendo. Bad doggo. Bad doggo. Oh my, oh my god. I can't take out all these. Excuse me. I was feeling kind of optimistic, but not anymore. Ow, wow, wow, wow. Bloody hell! Fucking hell! Oh my god, absolute scenes! Absolute scenes, guys! Fucking hell! Are we good? Freaking Doggers puts on dirty caution as well! Oh, that was so bad! <laughs> I actually thought it'd be pretty chill taking him out with the handgun. Right, hang on. See what's here a sec. <laughs> yeah, literally had a whole pound of doggos, didn't we? Hell no. Nah. If I just head outside, there's usually loads of green herbs here. Whether they'll be substitute for something else, there probably will be. Oh, bollocks. Oh, my. Y'all taking all my ammo. I ain't happy about this. Oh, man, now we're on danger as well. Oh, nice, we do need that. Um... Sorry guys, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to get another first aid. <laughs> it's too cray cray out there. You know, if, if they ain't supplying us, I know it's a randomised, but if they ain't supplying us the goods, I'm I'm gonna have to heal Bobby Kendo myself. Cause he makes me feel all guilty, you know, when he's he's holding himself like that. <laughs> That's right, Tom. Bad doggos. I know it is not what we like to see, not what we wanna see. Oh my god! I kinda need to be down there to use the um the heart key. Oh shit. <laughs> wow, shall we come back to this? No, not me, Becca. You you guys first. You guys can go first. I'ma wait for you guys. I'm I'ma chill sip my coffee and you guys can go first. Have you got enough um <sighs> It's not not the most effective, that is it. I was just going to use up the bit of the bow gun, you know. Oh, nice! Come on. That's the bow gun out. We might be able to get a few of these from here, actually. Is it reaching? I don't think that's quite reaching them. We'll be able to take them, won't we? Come on, you've got to be a big gal, Hull. Sorry, I'm sorry, Bobby. Come on. Come on, guys, when all the odds seem against us. <laughs> oh, they, that was where the spade key was. No. Damn it. So uh, we kind of... Um, I couldn't think where it could have been, so I didn't actually need to respawn it in because it was there. But I, I ditched it because the because the spiders were there. Damn it! My apologies for that. That's fine. That's fine. What's going on, Dave? Retro Hub fellow streamer in the TikTok chat. What's going on, my dude? Thanks for stopping in with us, Dave. Guys, if you love, obviously, I know I know you guys love your retro games. Um, please go and uh, show Dave uh, some love, Retro Hub fellow streamer out there. The Tomb Raider GOAT. I'm, I'm aiming to try and finish up Tomb Raider 2 tonight, Dave. I've got like three levels left. I'm going to try anyway. I'm going to try. <laughs> now we did good with that. It's got to make the most of that height advantage, haven't you? You know, like where we could just kick, um, kick their ass on the stairs when they, they, they couldn't uh, reach us. It's like uh, a little bit of MC Hammer can't touch this. Uh, right, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to make this, guys, into an empty slot. You know, where this spade key is, because we actually don't need it. Just 
to make that a empty slot. There we go. What a tit, as if it was there, it was hiding under all the spider booty. <laughs> What's going on gaming tech? Welcome on in. Oh no. <laughs> you can back out of there as well, because we're going to be putting that fire out at some point. Oh, and you're in the way there, hell nah. Yeah, you've been slowing a bit with Tomb Raider, Dave. Yeah, I'm hoping to um, get it finished up. Um, and then I will do another... I'll do, I'll do like a little Tomb Raider 3 stream sometime, you know, chilling and vibing on that around the mansion, the quad bike, get a feel for the game. But um, yeah, I, I feel like I do need a bit of a, a break from Tomb Raider once I've completed this second one. Do need a little bit of a break. Uh, we can't already got a handgun. Tell you what, we'll take it with us anyway. What's behind this? <laughs> Freaking moths waiting for us. Hell no. Freaking moths just letting themselves in. Oh, hell no. Yeah, I feel like that uh, should be Kendo's kind of kind of theme song on Resident Evil, you know. I'm so in love with Kendo. He opens the shop in RE2. So please give a little respect to Bobby Kendo. I think that that's so him, isn't it? Do you reckon he listens to like Motorhead or something like that? Do you reckon he's a Metallica kind of guy? Maybe if he's in a heavy sort of mood. Or maybe, does he like his country music though? Potentially. Right, we can't actually put the fire out yet. Um. I don't know if that's going to give us a key item or not if we go in and develop it. I'm not sure. Um, we do kind of need to go use those. So we'll go use those. Um, what can we use for the... Uh... Zolo's moths, isn't there? Acid rounds are good. I think that's all we've got, innit? We've used all the grenade rounds. Oh, we could do with that flamethrower as well, couldn't we? Right, I'll tell you what. Let's try and get that flamethrower where all those nemis are. What's going on, Shan? Awesome to see you. How you doing, sweet? Thanks for stopping in with us this morning. We're on a, a cheeky, brutal randomizer. So we're playing classic Resident Evil, um, you guys, um, where everything is like randomised and it is a little brutal right now. <laughs> it ain't a straightforward randomizer. Right, I, I, I want to go get... Um, hmm. I want to go get that flamethrower. Oh, actually, we have got enough room. Hang on. Right, see if we can go get it. Yeah, glad you're well, Shan. I'm doing all right, thank you. I feel like I'm kind of coming down with the G-Virus a little bit. I, I proper feel kind of viral symptoms kicking in, but it's fine. I'm, I'm like not quite 100%, but I'm good though. I wanted to um, smash it with a double stream today. So that's what we're aiming for. Get... Ow! Get off Bobby! Please get it, get it, get it. There we go. I'm going to have to spawn in some health, I think. Fucking hell. Fine, we managed it. Come on. Yeah, they've got a little bit of the G vice. I don't know. It, it might just wear off, I think. But we good. We still chilling. We still vibing. So we can go up there. Um, uh, should yeah, we'll go through this way. But yeah, hoping you guys, uh, Monday morning's going well. Let me know what you guys are up to. You, you guys having a chill day? 
Or are you on uh, on shift? If you're on shift, I hope you're having a wicked uh, shift so far. I have got you guys covered for the next couple of hours. I'll be on there another couple of hours or something. We'll see. We'll get as far as we can on the randomizer. Did you actually, Shan? Come on. That is a day off well spent. Booked a day off to nap. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I, I had a pretty solid sleep last night. Well, you know. Want to be up for the Resident Evil breakfast show. Oh, bless you. Liam's on shift. Uh, Becca's working tonight. Tim Shot, thank you for the follow. Everything's randomised, Tim. Everything. But yeah, um, I'm actually wearing these little shades because um, it actually helps just because I've been feeling a bit rough. It's, it's pretty much gone now, but I had a sore head. Um, so it just um, it just reduces like the glare when I'm um, concentrating, that's all. So it's, it's real good. So they're making things a bit more easier and chill. <laughs> oh, use that because it, it puts on dirty caution. Thank you, Angelo, for the follow. It's painful, isn't it, Liam? <laughs> it is, my dude, it is. We've got some fuel as well. I think we have, actually. Yeah, we've got a little bit there. Come on, we'll go use that on the... Uh, We've got that, and then we've got the acid rounds, haven't we? Yeah. Right, let me sort this. I'm going to take out a shitload of moths in the library. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that looks good. Right, we'll go vibe with that. I'm looking forward to this, guys. Come on, now we've got the firepower. Anna's Cafe, thank you for the follow. Bless you, Becca. So I was trying to play Ari 1 Remake, but the twins won't leave me to concentrate. It does require some concentration, that, doesn't it? You know what? Like, years ago... Um, God, I'm talking like 10 years ago now or something. I did, like, play it to death, and I knew it like the back of my hand, but because I'd had like, some years away from it, man, it's, it's a bit tough to go back to, innit? You do have to concentrate on it. You've got to make sure as well that you're using the kerosene to burn all the zombie bodies, aren't you, so they don't, like, resurrect and come back as the crimson heads. They come back hella stronger. Oh, nice. Halfway gamer, dude. Where else are you stopping in from, man? So my day hasn't started yet. It's 7.46am. Man, you, so you're like four hours behind us right here in the UK. Right, let's go get these. Why have I just... I've just, <laughs> I've just got so hyped I've unequipped the flamethrower. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Get off the Tims. Get. I'm a fry, y'all. Not gonna be happy. He's wearing his Levi's, his Tims. We don't wanna mess up this morning. Come on, come on. Nice. Is it round there? Oh, it's through there, I think, innit? Did I move the bookcase? I did, didn't I? Let's go get it. So Yeah, we need to clear these guys so we can do the, the cheeky puzzle. Get! Get! Have You're practically dead! There we go. Lovely. Dirty caution. This is a rough-ass randomizer, this is. <laughs> Dakota, thank you for the follow. Hey, what's going on, Jess? Said, hey, from California. Hell yeah, positive vibes out there this morning. Come on. Whereabouts in Cali are ya? I used to live in like North Cali. All that for a cheeky green herb, come on. And then all the actual key items that we do need, they're just literally lying around and you just casually pick them up, but everything we have to graft for, it's literally just an ink ribbon or a green herb. <laughs> Absolutely has our pants down on this. Well, it, it has um, Kendo's Levi's down. Right, nothing else in here, is there? We good, we good. <laughs> You've been productive, Shan. 
So I'm going to put my bedding indoors. I actually need to do the same, but my, my uh, work uniform, that has to take priority. So that's next. I basically, um, yeah, I have to prioritise stuff. So I prioritise my chill gear, <laughs> all my chill stuff. Um, that's been washed. That's almost done. After this stream, I'll, I'll, I'll um, throw my work gear in. And then after that, um, then the bedding can go. It is crazy, isn't it? Like adult life, man. Adjusting to this bullshit. Having to prioritise what need, what to wash next and everything. It's crazy. <laughs> it's absolute cray-cray. I still miss Mumsy looking after me. Bless her. Thank you, Jess, for the follow. <laughs> You're going to nap with no bedding, Sham. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> I'm the same, though. I, I, could, I could nap... Um, Without any like bedding, and I, I can I could like fall asleep on a washing line, literally. Come on, are we dropping down? Um, mm, I don't think this is the right thing to do yet because if I drop us down, I might lock us out. If this makes sense, we need to go down. You know where we use the heart key? We need to go through there. We need to meet Ada or whoever the character will be on this randomizer. We need to move the the truck. Otherwise, we'll drop down there. And the truck will be in the way. Or, the, or it should be anyway, so I could, you can kind of soft lock yourself out. So just bear with us on this one. I've got to kind of do it in order. So we'll go through the heart key room to the basement now. We good. Basement jacks. Where's your head at? Where's your head at? Hey, Steve C. Good morning, man. And Alan Evans. Great to see you, man. Uh, Anthony as well. Happy Monday to you as well, my mate. How you doing, Anthony? What's going on, Natalie? It's going good, thank you. Thanks for asking. I'm with you on that, Sean. There absolutely isn't enough time in the day. Uh, Bastiklu as well, thank you for the follow. Thanks, guys. It is popping in here today. Thank you very much. Um, right, so we'll go, go this way, I think. Head on down this way. Actually. So if I go through there, go through there... Uh, yeah, that's fine. If we go this way, then we don't have to go down that Nemi corridor. I'm being uh, being tactical, you know. But yeah, I'm, I'm with you what, what Shan said, you know. Like, I, I wish there was more time in the days. Um, it's crazy. I always feel like life just moves at like 100 miles an hour. And I'm just trying to... I'm always just scrambling to keep up. But a lot of it's self-inflicted because I have to be busy. I have to be working towards something. Like, honestly, guys... Um, like I wanted to jump on stream last night but again I wasn't like 100% uh, and I was like oh my god and it was driving me insane honestly like because if, if I'm not streaming or at least streaming when I'm scheduled or when I'm wanting to um, I feel like guilty I feel awful kind of because I kind of never want to let you guys down I feel guilty from an individual perspective because I'm like I want to be productive I want to be doing stuff I need to be growing the platforms I want to be out there um, yeah, it's just my mindset, you know. I always have to be, like, doing something, you know. It's, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's mad. <laughs> right, we've got three of the four plugs. That's good. We'll take the cord with us as well, because we'll place that in the thing. Yeah, 100%. 100% chance. If you're resting and worry about things, it's not rest. Yeah, it, it's difficult for me to fully switch off sometimes. I find it difficult to fully just settle down. I, I, like, I'm aware of it as well. Like, I, I literally kind of tell myself off. I'm like, hold, you need to just switch off from it, you know? I am fully aware of it. But yeah, it's just a case of, yeah, trying to switch off. <laughs> I'm extra cheeky saves. So we haven't actually uh, saved in a little while. But yeah, we're not doing too bad. I think we're doing all right, actually. Hopefully find some more health down there. If not, I'll spawn a bit. It's fine. <laughs> but yeah, 100%. I, like, I wish we didn't have to sleep. Um, I've said it before, like, you know, in a funny way. Like like what Shan said, Natalie said. It, it's like a waste. I find it like such a waste of time. I'd rather just not. I'd rather just be awake all the time. Or just at least, like, if you need, like, a, a cheeky half-hour nap or something. I can... I can cope with that. What's going on, Mike? I said, where you been? <laughs> and then Liam said, we've missed you, but you need to get feeling better. I know, I know, guys. <laughs> I 
I know, I hate it when I'm not quite 100%, because I feel like it just throws everything out. Like, I'm still not quite 100%. Like, I, I feel like I'm... I don't find um, coming down with, like, viral symptoms that solid. Like, I felt typically, like, very virally, <laughs> very G-virus, like, last night. And then this morning, I was like, oh, man. But I picked up a little bit. Um, so, yeah, I'm hoping to obviously be back on tonight uh, to stream Tomb Raider as well with you guys. Um... But yeah, I hate having to schedule a stream and then be like, oh, I'm not I'm not well enough to stream it. These things happen, and I know you guys are very understanding. I know you guys always turn up, you're always supportive. But still, it, it's just my mentality. I hate it getting in the way and, you know. Always use the cord down here. Here we go. Lovely. <laughs> Shad, bless you. Whole turned up to resuscitate me i'd take the l with the lack of sleep she gets <laughs> no i can assure you it will be optimal don't you worry shan <laughs> hell that no, we never take the l we never take the l <laughs> i know that's right liam and the thing is it's like I don't feel like 100% now, like, I, I kind of don't feel like, um, you know, sometimes I have to, I can't take this now, um, sometimes to make decisions like that, like last night, to say, like, I, I kind of know deep down, like, in myself when I'm not well enough to stream, and the thing is, it's not fair on you guys, because I can't give 100%, and I'm not saying I'd be in a bad mood, or I wouldn't be bothered, or anything, it's not like that, you guys would notice a difference in me, like, if I'm not feeling, you know, too good. If I'm a bit ill or anything, you guys would notice the difference and you'd be like, oh, you, you're not yourself, you know? So that that's the problem. I just wouldn't be like my normal self, you know? That's the problem with it. And it, yeah, it, it all frustrates me. I was really frustrated last night. I hate being ill. It, it completely throws my schedule out. I've always got things scheduled, booked in. And it, it drives me crazy. Yeah, thank you, AC. Um... When am I doing San Andreas again? We, we can definitely do another retro night on GTA San Andreas. I really enjoyed that one. That was really cool going back and playing that. Um, so yeah, we'll definitely be doing some more retro nights. With some more uh, PS1, PS2 nostalgia. Hell yeah. Mm, let's see what's in here. Let's see what awaits. But yeah, I get, I get you, Tom. I, I'm the same. I preach at other people. I preach at other people. My friends. I'm always like... Look after number one. Your health's more important. And then when it comes to me, I'm like, uh, I, I need to be doing this. I need to do this. You know what I mean? So I I do dish out advice. I do preach it. Then I don't listen to myself. <laughs> I'm guilty of it. Now, these doggos I can handle. Oh, I thought there's three. There's like four, I think. I can handle these doggos. There was like double the amount of doggos in that other one, one that where I had to just whip out the shotty to hotty. Where is it? Is the one around? Is it going derpy or something? Where is it? I can hear a dog. I think it's going derpy somewhere. We'll leave y'all to glitch. Oh, hell no. Uh, Steve C said, I think I know the answer. <laughs> I think you do. Uh, but which do you prefer, the original or remake of RE2? It's the original all the way for me, mate. Um, so I've been trying to do all the fouls of Mr. Raccoons in the remake. Yeah, it is a, like a cool challenge to set yourself, isn't it? Oh, I kind of already spawned in the lighter earlier. Yeah, I'm going to have to uh, leave that, guys. <laughs> we, uh, we spawned it in. So it's fine. Oh, I know AC. I know. Uh I find it a bit bizarre that the Vice City one got removed, but the San Andreas hasn't. Because um, when some of the language was coming up, I was I was cringing inside on stream. I was like, oh, this is me getting cancelled. But I've seen other people stream it, and I I think I've kind of got away with it, uh, luckily. But I think what I did what I did in San Andreas, I switched the um, I switched the radio stations off, and I think that's what has made it okay ish. Because I think the problem with the Vice City, I think it was like the sheer amount of copyrighted music. I don't know, because it, yeah, it even got removed, like, on YouTube. Um, but we can definitely restream it at some point. We'll, we'll go back to it, you know? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Vomitex as well, thank you for sending over that, Rose. Man, I appreciate that. 
Oh shit, I, th I thought I heard that. I second guess myself, guys. I thought I heard doggo footsteps, then I thought, oh no, it's just the surface. I thought it was like the... What, whatever it is. It's not carpet, is it? It's like mud or something. <laughs> whatever it is. I thought it was just like the, the floor. So it was doggos. Bad doggos. Who let the dogs out? Yeah, I thought it was just that. But it was doggos. Kendo been getting beat up this morning. Um, what was you saying, Sean? Let's have a look. I can't guarantee I'd be any good. Question about bedding. Do you do your bedding up to stop the pillow? Oh, fucking hell! What are you doing in here? What the hell y'all doing here? This is meant to be a safe room, fish. <laughs> do you do your bedding up to stop the pillowcases getting in the duvet cover? No, I don't. I just throw it all in. Yeah, Beck said throw it all in. Yeah. Yeah, just throw it all in and then, then just just go cray cray with it when, when you take it out. I, I, yeah. If, if I can't find the pillowcase or whatever, I just, I just throw it all... Throw it all like in the air and stuff. <laughs> and yes, before you say anything, I can do bedding. I do have little T Rex sounds, but I can do bedding. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Eddie G Live, for sending over the diamond. Come on, send over the little pumped up. Don't you know? Pump it up. Whole stream is going up. Don't you know? Pump it up. Come on. Thank you, my mate. Too kind. I, I love sending that diamond to other people as well. I love sending that to other people. Come on. Don't you know? Pump it up. The stream is going up. Come on. Right, we'll make a little save. We'll continue. We're doing good now. I feel like we, we had a real slow start. E even I did. Um, <laughs> waking up and facing the day. I felt real sluggish. Um... But like, it's like I wanted to stream, but I, I, I didn't feel quiet. I was like, Ugh, I feel a little sluggish. I need to sort myself out. I need to freaking, need to freaking wake up, Hall, you know? Um, we are going to need, I'll take we're going to need in a bit. Um, I'll take that manhole opener with us. Need the red card key as well. Go use them. Hell yeah. Yeah, I will do, Shan. I've actually almost finished my coffee, so I'm going to go get a water. I'll tell you what I'm going to get. I'm going to get one of my flavoured waters. Um, do you know about sips, Shan? And anyone else? Does anyone else like H, the rapper? I always explain it every time I drink it because people are like, what is that? It's, it's literally, it's a drink he's just brought out called Sips. And it was to keep him, like, hydrated because he, he didn't drink enough water. And it's basically right. It's fizzy water fizzy flavoured water but hear me out it does not taste like tv static i promise you it's not that kind of water oh, bollocks get the power on first um yeah it's really nice um so yeah I'll, I'll go get a can of sips in a second you having a cheeky monster becca come on i think i might have a monster a bit later on actually i might do i've got a, a couple of the white pineapple flavour that is something else man I'm seeing that a lot more now in the shops, luckily. It's getting like easier to get hold of. It's like my favourite flavour right now. White pineapple. So nice. But no, H is fizzy water. This is different. I've got to... I can't stress it off. This is different. <laughs> it's not like typical fizzy water you'd, you'd buy. It is something else, man. It is so good. <laughs> Nice. We'll go see what's in here. See if I can pick up uh, much stuff. Oh, shit. Ooh. I don't know what's going to work on these the best. Th these are bad. These aren't very good, these. Right. Just have to go for it. Oof. These are off, um... Fucking hell. Oh, my God. <laughs> these are off Resi 1, these are. Woo! Somebody put us on danger! Woo! Somebody got 911! Kendo taking the hook in the weapon storage! Whoa! Hell nah! 
Hell no! That was freaking rude. Damn. Yeah, there are some uh, flavours of monster in it that are, that are hard to, to come by, for sure. Right, so we'll take the machine gun. Right, okay. I.e. the, the increment. Um, and then we'll, we'll take that side pack as well. It's very useful. Give us a couple of um, extra um, inventory slots. Fuck clear. <laughs> uh, guys, I know you'll appreciate this as well, Becca. I have not told you guys yet, but you will never guess who I was talking to last night on a video call. You will never guess. I was talking to this guy, the OG Barry Burton uh, live action actor, Greg Smith. He literally called me last night on a video call. How cool is that, man? I was absolutely honoured. He's the one who plays Barry Burton in RE1. He did do the voice acting. He did the um, the, the live action sequence, obviously, where it shows them uh, the beginning and, and the end sequence. I basically contacted him um, over on Facebook because he's actually got his own uh, fan group. It's called, uh, I think it's called The First Barry Burton. So please feel free, guys, to head on over. He's very interactive with fans. He's real awesome. I actually just dropped him a message on Facebook. I just said, like, uh, Greg, could I get some signed prints? He does basically sign prints and, and stuff like that. Um, can customize for you, them for you and things like that and he didn't like he doesn't like actually kind of ready charge for them it's like more for the uh, postage um so yeah it's real awesome he literally has he's put together that for me um so like there's, there's various like signed prints and, and stuff like that a dog tag a stars um patch uh, stuff like that uh, and he's put stuff like um you were almost a holster sandwich and i hope this isn't holster's blood hope this isn't holster's blood yeah he's put that on and uh yeah, so that was absolutely insane to have a video call with him last night. I was absolutely... I, I couldn't believe it when he said Greg Smith is calling you. I was like, what? I was like, you're fucking kidding me. I was like, what? So yeah, that, I was so hyped last night. I was like, wow. Couldn't believe it. he called up last night. Yeah, and he, he said, like, I don't usually do this, but he's like, you know, you put this request in, so I just wanted to run through it with you and blah, 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 and what I can get sorted for you. So I think he just did it, obviously, you know, because it's uh, easy to, um, you know, to, to organise and stuff. So, yeah, I had a real quick chat with uh, Greg. It was awesome. Absolutely surreal. Like, I did say it to him as well. I said, like, um, I said, it's incredibly surreal to, to talk to you. Like, so I just said, like... I've literally played the game since I was like five or six years old and, you know, to talk to the actual Barry Burton. I was like, it, I'm absolutely like, it's so surreal. But I said, thanks so much, you know, for very kindly uh, taking the time out. So awesome. Who we got? Is that Steve? It's Steve! I would have killed more. But I thought that you needed a workout. I thought you were one of them. Once I find it, I can finally escape from this crazy island. I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Check it out! I pulled through without a scratch. I even saved ammo for future use. Father. 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 <laughs> Bro, Kendo ain't gonna be your daddy. Hell no. Nah. Thought I wouldn't make it. Bro, you you just let you walk to the back of the truck. I thought I wouldn't make it. <laughs> bitch, absolute bitch. I hate Steve. Hate Steve. Um, I don't have to come back for that because th th there's other things you need to be picking up. Uh, Adrian said what? And Nenzo showed. Thank you guys coming in with the follows. All right, let's help uh, Pussy Steve. Freaking hate Steve. It's the end of his story. <laughs> Steve, I was actually in the living room. I, I should have told. Well, actually, you know what? I could say I took the call in the dining room. Because I, I, I do eat in the living room, so I've actually not got... I still haven't got, like, a little table and chair yet for the kitchen. Sorry about that. Chief Irons, what? 
So yeah, we, we could actually class that, Steve, that I, I did take the call in the dining room. I'll be examining this. This call from the OG Barry Burden. What the fuck? <laughs> um, yeah, I'll, I'll take that. We'll find a box. We'll come back some, for the goods, you know. Oh, honestly, Shan, I could listen to the footsteps on this all day, every day. Hella satisfying. I wish I had those um, IRL, like when I'm um, going around my house. I wish I could mod my footsteps to sound like that. So see what these are. Oh, the freaking emblem. <laughs> Bro, we needed that a long time ago. We'll come back for these items anyway. Um, we'll see what's in here. Hey, good morning, uh, Nenzo. Thank you for being here from Brazil. Hell yeah, positive vibes, man. And Eddie G, thank you for sending over all those diamonds for us. Massively appreciate that. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Please, sir! Cease fire immediately! I thought you were one of them. Regina! You know what else is weird? I've checked the stats on all the residents and soldiers, but I couldn't find any profile fitting her description. It's like she doesn't exist. Why don't we cooperate? You know what else is weird? I've checked the stats on all the residents and soldiers, but I couldn't find any profile fitting her description. It's like she doesn't exist. Uh-huh. And how many people were sacrificed before you made this discovery? I'll go over to the back deck and manipulate the control panel for the brake. Then you apply the brake from here, okay? But don't you worry, girly. <laughs> you'll be safe in here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. Well, it's the idiots the case. in charge had us operating based on wrong information. But we couldn't just go back home empty-handed, oh no. If you find anything, give me a call, all right? Hey, Queenie! Feast on this! Hey, you managed to stop the train. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Don't screw up, okay? Sorry about that. Oh, I'm glad I could be of service. Time to go inside. I've only got two choices left. Either report to the Marines and serve out my sentence, or keep on running for as long as I can. That's all. I don't recommend the diving in this resort. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I know, I know Kendo, right, is a man of very few... Um, dialogue lines right but it just fits so perfectly just every time by the time i know something was wrong you know don't you worry girly i've only got two choices left either report to the marines and serve out my sentence or keep on running for as long as i can that's all <laughs> the sorry about that is so good right every time every damn time sorry about that <laughs> what's going on Perpetsu? So, you seem to know me. Been <gasps> fantasizing about me, have you? Fine. Now take these with you. Oh, he ain't messing around. He's gone and got Billy. It's very fitting that Billy was in the cell as well, because he's actually, um, for anyone who doesn't know, Billy is the convict from RE0. It's very um, fitting he was in there. Hell yeah, Papetsu. Thanks for being in from Portugal. Hell yeah, man. So yeah, we've kind of already done some things back in the station, so that's why it's like responders coming out of that vent. I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. So, you seem to know me. Been fantasizing about me, have you? <laughs> Sorry about that. The train line of derail. Kendo's been rumbled. <laughs> in fantasize about me, had you? Oh, sorry about that, babe. <laughs> I couldn't help it. His porn hub was down. I report to the Marines and serve out my sentence. Or keep on running for as long as I can. That's all. I thought you were one of them. You are kind of. He is now. Around, so, I'm afraid our little chat time is over. 
Yeah, no shit. They ain't gonna be safe inside you. I'm keeping a close eye on you. I'm gonna be fantasizing about him anymore. Once he gets Ashley back, his job will be finished. He'll no longer be a factor. I don't know what to do. By the time I noticed <laughs> something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. He just does not know what's going on. Sorry about that. Just do something. There we go. I wonder if this is a part of Simmons' plans. <laughs> that, that was the best part, man, when he got freaking rumbled. You've been fantasizing me, haven't you? <laughs> oh, sorry about that, babe. <laughs> Oh, it's so good, Sean. There is no chill. Honestly, when, when we play the randomizers, when everything's just totally shaken up, there, there is no chill at all. Oh, no. Bad doggos. Bad doggos. Hell no. Nah. I'm killing these doggos. They ain't getting out. Those doggos be like, I'm locked up. They won't let me out. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> That's what we'll be like, Shan. You know, you know, because you've thrown all your bedding, and obviously you can't find. If you can't like find your pillowcase or something when it when it comes back out, it's like I knew I should have tucked it in where where I, sh where I knew where it was. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Lovely. We'll come back for them. Use the long manhole opener. Hell yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that, babe. Thought you were one of them. I think we could do with. Um, we've got that. We've got the unicorn medal as well, haven't we? Mm. Do we use the save room there as well? <laughs> hey! Glad to yell. There's quite a few. Oh shit! I thought I had the uh, I didn't have the shotgun equipped. I just I just shot the handgun in the air. Oh, let's get the uh, the headshots. There we go. You have some kendo headshots. Kendo headshots for everybody. You can have your bollock shots. There we go. Get off the Tims. He's gonna go mad at me. Get off the Tims. <laughs> Thank you, Wesker Cox, for the roast. Thanks for stopping in with us. Appreciate ya. What's going on, PS1 King? That is right. We, we we put Resident Evil together with a full English brekkie. Come on. <laughs> it's so good in it, man. Halfway gamers do that. This is hilarious. It, honestly, that's what I love about uh, the Byron randomizer. Just brings together the the most unlikely combinations. You know, they're so damn good. Take that. He's grows ain't loyal, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Oh, can make a fair spando ballet herb as well of the string. Come on. Uh, we can combine those as well. Got all the plugs there as well, that's good. Got a spark shot. Awesome. Thank you for the follow as well, Wesker Corpse. <laughs> That's it, you can blame Kendo. Don't blame it on the whole damn. Don't blame it on the stream chat. Blame it on the Kendo. Sorry about that, babe. But I thought you would find uh, everything if you did the sheets up. 
I thought you would find them. Pop those together. Right, there are all the plugs, that's good. Pop them together. So we'll get that, get that. Yeah, we, we do have to go back to the RPD because we, we do need to see if we can find that valve handle because we need to put the fire out to then go deposit those jewels. So we still haven't done that yet. So I'm just going to say, I'm just going to take a real quick break as well, guys. Just go use the bathroom, just go uh, get a drink as well. But hell yeah, guys, we've got our first cheeky Spando ballet here. Come on. Oh, we'll have to definitely sham. We'll, we'll release some uh, Sorry About That Babe merch. We'll do that. I'll 100% make sure um, we've got that as a cheeky uh, cheeky merch design. I got you. Uh, yes, yeah, so we need to go use this. I did find a film reel, didn't I? And I didn't pick it up. I need to go find it. Need that. We need to go back to the cell as well for the unicorn medal as well. Uh, so yeah, we've got a few things to use back at the station. So we'll go and do that. So yeah, just bear with me. Um, so we'll make a save. I'll be back in a few minutes, guys. All right, just give us a few. I'll leave you guys um, with Bobby Kendo, the Dead Crows Ain't Loyal, and the RE4 save room thing. Um, what's going on, Nevin? Thanks for stopping in with us. And Ellie as well, what's going on? Hope you guys are all doing well. Um, yeah, I'll be back in just a few minutes, guys. All right, just going to go to the bathroom, get a drink. Okay, just give us a few.
I'm back, guys. Thank you for your patience. I appreciate you. Thank you. I come bearing some lemon and lime flavoured water. And uh, I've got 10 fast sticks as well in case we get a little snacky snacky. Come on. Not snacky snacky as all the enemies have been for Bobby Kendo this morning, though. Hell no. Right, let's get us back to the uh, the police station. What's going on, Aaron? Great to see you, man. But yeah, thank you guys for your pace. I do appreciate that. Thank you very much. Right. So we've got that. We'll head back to Z cell. Hell yeah, let's crack open that sweet H. Oh, come on. Oh my god, thank you so much, man. We got a massive raid coming in over on Twitch. Hell yeah. Thank you very much. Damn, I'm still a bit of a noob, by the way, guys, um, who are raiding. So I do apologise for the, the lack of, like, alert and stuff. I'm still a little bit of a noob over on Twitch. Um, we are multi-platform streaming right now over on, obviously, Twitch. Um, and I'm also Holster TV over on YouTube and TikTok. Um, but, man, thank you very much. Let's go check these guys out. So we've got a massive raid coming in. Super Sleepy T with over 100... Um, Raiders, thank you very much, guys. We're currently playing uh, the original RE2 as uh, Bobby Kendo, as our beloved uh, Robert Kendo, as you'll uh, most likely recognise as the uh, the gun store owner. But yeah, thank you very much. Appreciate you guys. We're currently nearing uh, my first, you know, kind of major milestone on on Twitch as well, which is our first almost a thousand uh, followers on there. Hell yeah. So thank you guys. Bobby Kendo thanks you. That's it, Kendo. You, you look at them. You thank them. <laughs> well, thank you very much. We've got uh, Hans Hayes. We've got uh, Astora Souls. We've got Super Sleepy T themselves as well. Uh, Evan uh, Angelical. Um, oh my god. Oh, sorry. Hang on. My bad. Sorry, I messed up the, the chat. There we go. Yeah, Byrons are always awesome. Lucy Berry as well, great to see you. Thank you. Sorry, I'm trying to scroll the chat. I keep messing it up. Um, man, that's so awesome. Thank you so much, guys, uh, for stopping on in with us. But yeah, um, just to introduce myself to the new Raiders, um, I am Holster, and I usually stream Resident Evil and other survival horror games. Uh, we do stream some other retro as well. We do love to relive the nostalgia in other uh, retro games. So yeah, we are doing... Uh, some of those streams as well uh, nowadays. But yeah, thank you for uh, stopping by with us. I think this was a, uh, a film reel, wasn't it? We are going... Ah, get off! Get off his booty. Oh, no, it's not. Where did I find the film reel? Was it in that... Um... Hang on. <laughs> Damn. Hope you guys ain't scared of spiders. Oh, my God, there's so many. Get off Kendo's Levi's. You will not be happy. <laughs> I love the Kendo emoji there as well. He, he is in a freaking love Bobby Kendo. I think I left a film reel like in here. So yeah, we've got a few things to use up um, back in the RPD. So we're going to go backtrack briefly. Oh, it's not this one. That was the lighter as well, wasn't it? Well, I can't remember where it was, but I will try and backtrack. And um, in case there's any key items. But what, watch them totally be... Uh, be ink ribbons and, and a herb. It will 100% be that. 100% man. Oh, I think it was on this uh, in this hallway actually. Let's go have a little look. But yeah, welcome guys. This is Bobby Kendo's world and we just be living in it, you know? We just be living in it. <laughs> it's always Becca, always the damn ink ribbons. We'll go see, we'll see. Um, right, so what we've got. Um, Need to go to the main hall. Oh! I forgot about these. Ah, it's the Nemi hallway. <laughs> I don't ever want to go in there ever again. It's Bowfelly, so we're, we're playing as Kendo and we are in a randomizer, so everything's completely randomized. Come on, don't, don't you dare drop us an ink ribbon. 
I swear. Okay, I'll take that. <laughs> All 3% of the machine gun bullets. You asshole. <laughs> you fucker. Um, so if we go up there, we can use that. Right, I'll tell you what, we'll go up this way. It'll take us two minutes, then we'll go back to the basement. Then we've done everything we can down here. Yeah. <laughs> Absolute minging that uh, Nemi hallway. Hell no. Nah. When does this play in RE1? Is it when the it's the snake in it? The snake music. When we see Richard in it, there's a a giant snake. <laughs> I think it's that that music in it. Oh, I hate those things. They're so horrible. Leave me alone. Okay, fine. Got a little bit of bullets from these. Oh, one of them just jumped on Kendo's bollocks. <laughs> Surprised didn't do a shriek then. Ah! <laughs> I'm sorry, Barbie. I've got him so beat up this morning. He has been, honestly, we've been streaming for like two hours, man. We've only just got to like the basement. Some bio runs are, are pretty straightforward, but yeah, this one, I've had to, we've had to gravel pit a bit. You know the, the old school song, Gravel Pit? Check out my gravel pit. Back, back, back and forth. We're literally, yeah, uh, literally having to gravel pit. Yeah, you actually don't have to, Becca. I usually do for the drama, but um, yeah, every time I do try and pick up the um, the little uh, the crest, Yon still bites my ass. So I, I do take him out. But yeah, you actually don't have to. Oh fucking, honestly, <laughs> couple of bullets and a herb. <sighs> oh man, hey Vincenzo, awesome to see you, my lovely. How you doing? Thanks for stopping in with us. Said, so really love those glasses on you. Thank you. Um, I may be wearing them just now and again in streams, that's all. Um, yeah, it just reduces the glare a little on my eyes. It's just because my head was feeling a little sore earlier, that's all. Because I'm, I'm not quite, I just don't quite feel 100% at the minute. So, um, yeah, with my head feeling a little sore, I was like, you know what, I'm going to wear these. It just makes it a little, little easier on the eyes for the minute, you know? Just very useful. Um... I have not found, guys. We, we have not found the, the valve handle. So... So, I think I'm going to have to spawn in the, the valve handle so we can use those, do you know what I mean? So, yeah, I, I'm kind of going to have to do that. I'm sorry, I try and play it as legit as I can, but sometimes we need that little bit of... little bit of help, don't we, you know? Um... Oh, shit! Bollocks! Give me the red jewel back. I panicked then. Hang on. Valve handle. Lovely. Come on. That's what we want. We'll go head on back. Go head on back upstairs. Oh, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, if you don't get bit, obviously, you don't, you don't get to have your little nappy nap, do you? Your little poison nap. Yeah, I always end up getting poisoned. So I always end up having that little nap. Yeah, thank you, Vincenzo. Like I said, I've never uh, been one to have to wear glasses or anything, but um, I do notice after, after some time, my, my eyes do water a little bit. <laughs> but yeah, it just makes it nice and a bit easy on the eyes just while I'm not quite 100% at the minute. So it does help. So they are serving a purpose. I'm not kind of wearing them for a novelty. <laughs> it is like for a purpose. Reducing that glare a little, you know. Uh, Alistair Lover, what's going on? Welcome on in. And thank you guys for still dropping the likes and shares of the stream. Thank you very much for that. It helps us out there in that algorithm. Thank you very much. We've had some new people in as well, which is awesome to see. Yeah, a lot of RE1 music in this today. Very tense RE1 music. Yeah, we'll go put out the fire. Kendo, put out the fire. Yeah. Still lit. 
I know, Ellie. It's so it's so unsettling, isn't it? Because obviously in in the original games, it's kind of it just flows, doesn't it? Do you know what I mean? You know what music to expect where, but um, yeah, so, and some music's uh, very much more abrupt <laughs> in it in like other areas and stuff. Did I even get the? I can't if I checked that body because this is where there was all those doggos. Did I check that? Yeah, must have checked it. Got something. Astora Soul said Kendo is liking that song. He, honestly, he's been bopping all morning to everything. Oh, nice, Liam. So got an hour and a half off the phone, so glued to the stream now. Hell yeah. <laughs> Welcome on in, man. Glad you got some time to chill with us. Thank you for taking that time to, uh, to stop on by. Moth getting involved. I think it was on another randomised. There was there was shitloads of moths and I couldn't even get there. We had to take them out, didn't we? Oh, I, I remember there was a, a Birkin... Was it the Birkin boss? The G-Mutant. <laughs> yeah, there was that as well. Couldn't get past it. It is indeed a store of souls. It, it is uh, by rat. Thank you, Liam, for sending us all those roses very much. Thank you, man. Thank you guys for all of uh, your support this morning. And uh, yeah, which is now uh, actually this afternoon. You cray cray. Thank you, Jack, for the follow, mate. Welcome on in. Welcome to the freaking chaos. <laughs> Right, let's get them titty jewels. Forever falling into Tony's arms. Oh dear. Don't you worry, Kendo. We're keeping a close eye on things. Oh, Kendo's always got this. I proper felt like playing as Bobby Kendo this morning. I've played as Kendo a few times in Byrand. And I think it's just really cool because it just gives you more time with Kendo, you know? Time that we never got in the original. You know, it's very, it's very much, uh, it's very short and sweet, you know. Do, do you see how my voice softened then? I was like, yeah, you know. Mm. <laughs> oh, I get real sad about Kendo. I love Kendo. That's it. That's it, Becca. R.I.P. Kendo. He's so awesome, man. I mean, I do like the insight they gave, um, you know, into a little more of the backstory on um, RE2 Remake. You know, where you get to see himself holding his daughter and stuff. Which is inevitably going to turn, you know. Real heart-wrenching scene, that as well, that one. Gets you in the feels. Alright, we'll be going to face the first bossy boss, guys. Back down the basement. We'll be going back through. Past the cells. Uh, this way. Yeah, I, I, I do love um, the appearance of the, of the OG Bobby Kendo, though. For the most part, I, I always, uh, you know, prefer the OG reses in, in every way. I have indeed uh, a story. I have played Kendo's mod indeed. Yeah, yeah, I love... There's Kendo's cut and then there's Kendo's cut uncut in it, which is like literally Kendo's cut on steroids. It's freaking cray-cray out there. Oh, we didn't need to be in there, did we? It's fine. Harry 4 combat music in there. <laughs> but yeah, I'd, I'd love to restream uh, Kendo's Cut. I definitely would. Thank you, Paige, for sending over the diamond. Appreciate you. Thank you very much for your support. It's awesome to chill with you guys again. said it's wild how you know the music and which one it's from yeah pretty much can pretty much remember most of these 
Right, we're good with that with a minute. Um, put that away for now. Um, we'll take three of the plugs. Because I think if we do all four, we're just going to trigger the boss. We're not going to get the little uh, segment with the other character. So we'll just do the three. Make a little save as well. Just because we have done some backtracking, haven't we? There's been a lack of health items in this, isn't it? Oh, hell yeah, that's well good, Vincenza. So picked up a thousands of games in one emulator. Or to play with little Lorenzo, hell yeah. Yeah, I've, I've got ones, one like that. It's called, um, I think it's called like the Ultra Game Stick X2, I think it is. Um, yeah, it's, it's generally good. I got it from arcadesystems.com. It's legit, it's decent. Oh, I think we've got all four plugs. I don't think we get the little segment with the other thing. I don't think so. I've not even got any health. I'm going to have to spawn some in, I think. <laughs> we're not meant to have this boss just yet. We're meant to have the little segment with uh, where you should switch to Ada or whatever character we get. It's fine. We're going to spark shot the hell out of its ass. You're ready for like a thousand volts. Come on. Come on. It's these that do the damage. It's the little crawly things that do the damage. I'm just going to spam it. Get off me. I bet we're on... Right, we're still normal. Call. Hang on. Oh, I can't. I've, I've just took out a couple. The other ones are on his bollocks, so I can't exactly shoot Kendo's bollocks. He'd never forgive me. Let's get that other one. Oh, it's just jumped on us. Right, we got it, we got it. Hell yeah. You see though, that it's those that cause the damage, it's not the actual boss itself. Oh, pain in the ass. Oh, is that one still alive? Hell no. Keep off the Levi's. Off the Timberlands. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> So we've got three of the four. We'll go heal up anyway. I'll have to treat us to a little first aid spray, I think. <laughs> oh, I see. You're with stars. Judging from the age, that guy could be Marcus's son or grandson. It's going to be dangerous from here on in. I love how I said you must be stars. Poisonous. Damn it, give me serum. Okay, I trust you. Give me serum, but probably they all be one in the cow pole. Oh, nice, we've got OG Chrissy Redfield. Come on. So give me a second, let me just catch up with a few of you guys. Um, I know, yeah, I, I, I do hope, I, I do really hope they do a, a Resi 1 to 3 remastered collection. I really do. Um, it is cool to obviously play these, uh, you know, I can play them uh, in HD mods on the PC, but it's not accessible to everyone, and that's what it's about. I hate to know that, you know, some people are excluded, you know, from playing the HD mods, because, you know, there's a lot of people who comment and they say, I wish I could play this version, and it's a shame, you know, they need to bring it out, um, make it accessible for sure. Uh, build Baggins, so basically if you just search Byrand on Google, just search Byrand, I think it's like Byrand.net, and everything's on there. Download links, everything. Yeah, surely, you know, after the success of um, the Metal Gear Solid collection, Tomb Raider collection. Mm. It's got to be Resident Evil coming up, you know? Just give me a second. I'm just going to type it, okay? Just give me a sec. I'll type it in the chat.
I'm sure it's .net, but yeah, it's called Byrand. That's what the that's what the the randomizer is. I popped it in the chat for you, man. Thank you for the follow as well. Get. This is a puzzle area. There's no. There's no space for the zombie hands. Hell no. Nah. Trying to get a hold of our Chrissy. <laughs> yeah, my Byrand is hella addictive. I could play it like all the time, you know. Holster always says Byron's like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. <laughs> yeah, massively grateful for all you guys in uh, today. Thank you very much. The huge raid as well over on Twitch. Oh, hell yeah. I'm sure we should be able to use that one of those handguns we've got. Everything I'm to everyone else. To you. Yeah, no shit. How rude! And I don't believe there's any relevance with my figure and my standing. Who are you? Who? Are you? What are you doing here? <laughs> I thought that was a reference to the ballistic sign when she got all sassy there. <laughs> I think that's the Matilda. I think we can. Yeah, there we go. Lovely. Lovely. Yeah, been doing alright, guys. Been doing good. Um... Might pop that back. Um... Actually, I'll take this. See how we go with that. I could always mod in a, a little uh a little first aid if we need it. Oh I just need that last plug as well. Just grab that. Oh yeah, definitely hands. I, I think that's the for for the most part, I think most fans prefer uh Ari remake Ashley over the OG. I, I do definitely. She's definitely like a lot more useful and she's not like real whiny is she? Like you can never I think we all can never get over that. You, you know her whine in the OG. It's like Leanne <laughs> It was so damn annoying, you know. No, she she she's not too bad in the remake. I don't mind her, you know. I actually don't mind. <laughs> you tell him, Bobby. You bad guy. But you should be safe inside here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> I thought you were another one of those zombies. You cheeky bastard! But don't you worry, girly. You'll be safe in here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. How could they do that to me after everything I've done for them? I love how we dropped the girly line on Chief Irons. Come on. I love how he drops that on him. <laughs> At TMFC, thank you for sharing the live. Massively appreciate that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Right, this is bad. Just give me a second. Just give me a sec. 
I am going to have to get a first aid in. I should have uh, healed us up anyway, but um, just give me a sec. I'm going to have to get that in for us. Can't mess with that on dirty caution. Oh, see how this is with that. Oh, did that even... I don't think that's even getting it, you know. Oh, shit! Holy shit. Will this get it? Shit. Just give me a sec. I'm gonna have to get another one for us, guys. I, I wouldn't mind, guys. Honestly, I, I would ration the help, but we're getting nothing on this fire end. We've had no assistance at all. We've literally just got, like, red and, and blue herbs. Nicole has been pretty useful, actually. She's taken those out for us. What's going on, Turbine Guy? First time chat on Twitch. Welcome, man. Hey, we got Jillian with us. Uh, Belle, thank you very much for kindly dropping us those roses. Let's go! Thank you very much. Right, so... Shit, we got in here. There we go. Finally, a green herb. I've had the RE4 save music in like most of the save rooms, I think. It's been a nice vibe though, it's been good. Something on there, yeah. Nice. Oh, finally, it's, it's actually starting to come up with some uh, first aids and, uh, and green herbs. Byron's finally like, we best give this girl a fucking chance. <laughs> She's fucking struggling, look at her. She's a fucking man. She's having to spawn everything in, left, right, and centre. <laughs> Alright. Let's get us, uh, have another little Spando Bally Herb as well. It is spoiling us. Come on. Hashtag lucky gal. Let's go. Gold. We go need the lighter. There's a couple of things uh, in the basement. I'll take those. Gonna have to try and build up, um, especially the the magnum and the um, grenade launcher. You know, rounds. We need a lot. We need a lot for those. So you know, like for the end game and stuff. So I'm trying to ration those. Trying to accumulate some uh, bullets for us. You know, uh, tech recruiter. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate you, man. Right, so we can pop that back. We're done with that. That can go back with. We'll combine that up. I love how you can load the grenade launcher with hella rounds in this. Because I never liked how limited it was, you know, like in the first diary. Keep that on us. Yeah, that's good. Right, we'll go put that back. That's good. Make a little save. Uh, we do need the valve handle as well. I'm very 50-50 at remembering that. I think we can go uh, deposit that as well. Sure we can. So yeah, we'll go do that. Hell yeah, we're not doing too bad, guys. I'll put that back, because we have made a save. Try ration that health out of it. Um, let's have a look. Um, Steve said, which line do you think is the best line in all the RE games? Ooh. That, that is a tough call. Um, yeah, Steve said, for me, it's either Mikhail's Get Off My Train Shit Bird. That, that is awesome, that, in, in the remake. Or oh, Barry's Hmm, The Dining Room. Um, man, there's, there's loads in there. I, I'd probably say um, I'd, either Ada Wait, I think. How? 
Is that Chief Irons actually taking a bullet? Damn. Never thought I'd see that. I'd probably say, yeah, either Ada White, um, or I, I really like it where, um, I like where, where the frustration um, of Leon, you, you can see Leon's frustration is building when he's, um, when he's on, on the walkie-talkie. I think he's in the sewers. Uh, no, sorry, in the uh, the jail cells. Um, and then he's like, wait, Claire, wait, wait. And then he's like, damn, why would anyone ever listen to me? I like that, where his frustration literally builds up and he just openly, like, outright, like, vents it. I like that. I like as well when he goes, that maniac's got to ram us. I like that when, when the truck driver gets um, infected at the beginning of the game. Um... And then there's obviously there's the Jill sandwich line. There's the um, you're obviously Jill sandwich. Hope this isn't Chris's blood. Um, and then ag again in, in OG three as well. You want stars? I'll give you stars to to end off the game. You know, so many. You know. <laughs> Let's go. There's no need to stay. I love how... <laughs> she's at least looking like she's making a logical conversation. <laughs> That's umbrella. She must be upstairs. Ah. Ah. <laughs> you must be from the Bravo team. You mistaken her for Becky, Chris. Let's do it. <laughs> he was never surviving a good twatting from uh, Chrissy Redfield. That was wicked. <laughs> How did Misty even get that name? Because that, that female zombie, she's called Misty. Is it like her unofficial name? How did it come about? Do any of you guys know? I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Kendall, what has happened to your top? You absolute filthy animal. What's going on with that? <laughs> all your textures are messed up on your top, bro. Where's all your, your nice braces and stuff? <laughs> oh, what is he doing, man? Right, let's get the uh, cheeky medal and, and ting. Right, let's link ribbon. One whole magnum bullet, I'll take that. It's fine, we, we have got enough. Bollocks, man. Can we spark shot these? Oh! Fuck. I don't know if I can. I don't know if you can get me the two. Points. Nice, that's one down. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Lovely. Making Kendall get the freaking boomstick out. 
<laughs> yeah, that's actually not one of our brightest ideas, is it, Becca? In spark shot lighting up the water. <laughs> I never make decent decisions. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the hell no? <laughs> Yeah, that is a decent idea, Steve, for sure. The best uh, resi lines. There's so many in there. I, I do love it. Yeah, look at those monsters. <laughs> I love Becky Chambers as well. I'd love to see... Oh, I didn't even see him. He was camouflaged. Bruh. Told you that. This is where my trust issues stemmed from. When they, when they all play in dead. Oh, what? I literally thought there was like one body on the floor. How is there that many? Bruh. <laughs> Are they going to cr really crawl across that bridge that I'm making for them? Hell no. Nah. Get off Kendo's bridge. Hell yeah. Right, we'll go use that again for the upper. There we go. What's going on, Chris? I'm doing good, thank you, man. We also had James come in as well. What's going on, James? Thank you guys for taking the time to come in and uh, vibe with us today. We love a cheeky bio rand. Can't keep me away from it. Oh, Holster, not another bio rand. <laughs> yes, I'm afraid so. <laughs> I love it though, man, you know, it just shakes up the game, just keep it keeps it a fresh experience, you know. And you can literally mod it to your you know, your your skill level, to your taste, whoever you wanna play as. What randomized, you know, features you want from particular RE games. You can either include or exclude them. Really Great. awesome. Oh hell no, we ain't helping you, Annette. Hell no. Nah. <gasps> it's not even the crocodile, it's the it's um freaking yawn. I was about to drop my little inferior crocodile alligator. Kind of running down the tunnel like see you later. It ain't even inferior crocodile alligator, it's yawn! It's yawn! You uh eat up yawn. It it, it is beautiful to see you in a different scenario. Whoa, 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 it scooped that up. Yon's having his breakfast, let's go. You guys ready for this, for a cheeky fried yawn? Hell yeah. That is awesome. So good that they can replace the gator. And again, you can see things that, you know, you wouldn't expect to see. That we're not meant to see. Freaking yawn in there. Blowing yawn up in the canister. Really awesome. Trust Annette to be in the dumping area. Oh, it's Wesky now. Pesky Wesky. Go up on the ground and wait there. But you should be safe inside here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. There are a lot of locked rooms in that house. Check them out one more time. There must be a place to hide safely. I'll look around the house a little more. I'm sorry, but I have my reasons. Perhaps you guys have met them? It was all I could do to protect myself against those strange creatures. I thought you were one of them. Wow, what a mansion! I thought you were one of them. Tyrant virus is a super virus, which creates a monster which is much stronger than human beings. Tyrant is the most powerful biological weapon in the world. I thought she just shoved him out of the way. <laughs> I know patches up and now we're at Jillian Valentine. Come on. Alright, we're back to being Bobby Kendo. We're freaking Brian Irons. 
Could have someone else keeping us company, damn it. Thank you, Amy, for the follow. Said the remake has spoiled me. What are these graphics? Jeez, Amy, this this is actually um This is actually with a HD mod as well. This isn't even the OG graphics. <laughs> but yeah, it is a crazy difference, right? Is 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 Chief Fans doing the sherry thing? He's doing the sherry thing, look. You know if you run ahead too much, he'll just crouch down. <laughs> Look at him. Looks like he's having a right little strop. Bloody hell, Irons. What's going on, Rob? It's awesome to see you, man. And Marco DiCagno, thanks for the follow. Uh, Steve said, on the same vein, what's your worst non-boss enemy? Probably hunters or lickers. Both so very dangerous. Yeah, um, obviously you, you run the risk of them one shot and you don't if you even dare to row around on caution right um I, I know obviously the liquors can be just as deadly but i still the one that i actually um die the most from are the re1 hunters they still catch me out nowadays um the liquors not so much not so often i don't like the hunter gammas either especially like, you know like, like an re3 in the little um in the little lab the little lab room in the hospital and um within the Raccoon City Park as well. But yeah, by far, I think that the re one hunters, um, I get I get pretty scared, I get pretty like freaked once they, um, you know, they spawn back in the mansion when you're making your way back from the guardhouse, but more so in the caves. Um, that's my least favourite part of the game. And I think that the hardest part of the game, I think, the re one caves. I can get a little terrified at that. <laughs> Always dread the caves on RE1. I know, right? I was gutted they actually missed out the spiders on RE2 remake. They're wicked in this. Whoa, we got the OG zombies. Hell no. Nah. Bad thing, can they still be looking down? Let's take him out. Hell no. Ah! There's always one of them that gets hold of the Tims. Hell no. Yeah, that first zombie though, the first zombie head turn, you know? Thank you, Vincenzo. I'm glad you enjoy it. I'd really enjoy watching you play the old RE games. Hell yeah. Well, this is actually all, all the, the shit here is literally like what's not meant to happen obviously we are playing a randomizer so everything's proper shaken up so there's no structure to it whatsoever but that's the that's the beauty and the chaos of biorand right oh not a problem becca thank you so much for stopping in with us massively appreciate your support have an awesome rest of your day becca and like i say all being well i should be back on tonight on tomb raider 2 but yeah awesome to have you in as always take care Oh yeah, you are on shift, aren't you? Bless you. Hope you have a wicked shift. Hope it goes uh, fast for you. Think of me and my shift on Tomb Raider. <laughs> it fries my brain. My whole poor little brain. We'll get there, though. Got, just got a few levels left on Tomb Raider 2. I'm hoping to close it off tonight. Morning to you, Kevin. Thanks for stopping in with us, man. <laughs> yeah, the, the gammas aren't great, are they, Steve? Yeah, those hunter gammas, man. What about you guys? What what enemy um, do you dread facing the most in Resident Evil? Not talking boss, just general enemies. For me, in, in RE1, it, it's the it's the RE1 hunters. They're like the most deadly man. There's something about those. They look terrified as well. Like in the OG game. I love this music. This is the first um, Ada Wong music, isn't it? Who are you, Ada? Ada Schlong. And what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm looking for my bit of booty. His name's John. I didn't realise that, Vincenzo. There's Pokemon randomizers. Damn. 
I bet they're cool. I bet they're cool as hell. Nothing in here. Got a nice little chill area. See what these are. Oh, we do need that. We'll have to come back for that. Okay. We'll come back for those. We've got to come back for the key. What's going on, Tyler? Awesome to see you. How you doing? Oh, wow. That's mad, isn't it, Vincenzo? Especially if, like, you're not fully, like, equipped with, yeah, with your strongest lineup of Pokemon. You can just go into the grass and bump into legendary Pokemon. I bet that, that there's some tense-ass battles in that. I bet it's cray-cray, right? <laughs> right, let's get this all sorted. Um... Yeah, we use a spark shot. Can use a bit of the shotty to hot you as well, I think. We should be fine. Should be fine with those. Go back for them couple of items. Oh, bless you, Tyler. You out walking the doggos? It's been freezing, hasn't it? It has been proper cold. I've had the heating blasting all morning. YOLO. Oh, I just got stunned to be cold right now, you know? It has been freaking freezing out there. Hell no. <laughs> you know what makes back? I, I, I don't really remember that much about Ari Zero. Um, the Ari Zero Eliminators. Can't really remember too much about them, you know? But yeah, I would like to stream uh, Ari Zero at some point. Uh, I've, I have like quite a bit, a few requests um, to play that to stream it. So we'll do. Yeah, million percent, Amy. Um, the Tyrant and Ari Two remake. I'm not a fan. Oh, I'll just take it, just so we're not leaving it behind. Um, yeah, Tyrant in RE2 Remake and, um, well, yeah, Mr. X and um, Nemi in RE3 Remake. I just think they're very overpowered and I just don't understand how they can move it, like, Nemi can move at the speed of light and that kind of annoys me. And I don't like how, just the extent of how much um, Mr. X pursues you in, in the remake as well. I just think it's, it's a bit too much. I think it's a bit too overdone and they just need to chill with it a bit. They got a little carried away with it. And they should have just kept it for the... Um, for the B scenario as well. It definitely shouldn't be in both scenarios. Alrighty. Is there a key in this one or not? Nah? Not in this one, in it. We're popping it in the... Uh, I think it's in B scenario there's a key for that bit. No, no, it's the, the Ari 4 combat music as well. What's going on, Irish book? Yeah, spark shots should uh, start this next uh, boss. Thank you, Miss Clown. Said smashing it. Hell yeah, man. Thank you. We're going strong. We're going good at this randomizer. I think it's all right. It was quite a bit of a slow-ish start at first, but I feel like we gained momentum and we've been good. We've been good, man. Um, yeah, that's what it is. I keep saying like the gamma hunts. I don't think. Yeah. Um, Aaron said that the beta hunters. That, that's what they might be, yeah. On the on I three remake. <laughs> Simply can't play it without gun mods. <laughs> yeah, I actually want to purchase um RE2 remake, along with the other remakes as well. I, I wanna get those. Um so there's currently like a, a massive um sale on the RE games on, on Steam, so I do need to purchase them because I wanna be able to um to add mods to them for, for our streams and stuff, you know? Because I've done some, like, uh, you know, just just normal gameplay for us, but I, th I think if we could mod it, I think it'd be wicked. Uh, yes, Tom, I am just wearing glasses. I'm not just... I'm not quite 100% at the minute. I felt like I was maybe coming down with some viral symptoms. Um, and, yeah, my, my head's felt a little sore today. It's not as bad as it was. It's not as bad. But, um, yeah, it's just the glasses just help reduce the glare a bit, that's all. We're gonna have to open these tank plastics as well, I think, guys. Need a bit of a need a bit of a sugar rush as well. I've got a little sugar tablet in here. Yeah, I'm gonna have one of those as well.
get that damn glucose see us through the rest of the stream, you know. Yes! Couldn't have happened to a nicer character. Sorry about that, babe. <laughs> sorry about that. Don't be sorry, Kendo. <laughs> sorry about that, babe. Spark shot your ass, bro. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah, I usually use a spark shot with this one if I'm playing as Claire. And then the machine gun if played with Leon. It's decent for this boss. up your ass it's a great little weapon the spark shot do you guys like it it's ridiculous isn't it amy we've still been descending while we've been doing this um this boss battle <laughs> the lab is like freaking balls deep in it in the underground who are you what are you doing here? <laughs> but don't you worry girly you'll be safe in here I'm keeping a close eye on things. Biceps are freaking huge. How many scoops are? He proper scoops are like that. Just take and takes up a little portion of that. Hold on. Give you a shot now. Freeze. You're alive. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Nothing. What is this all about? I can't figure it out at all. Who are you? What are you doing here? Anyway, I have to open this room. I thought you were one of them. Well, he was talking about the world's most powerful biological weapon. Called Tyrant or something, I, I think. But you should be safe inside here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. <laughs> Thank you, Irish Book, for dropping those roses very kindly, my mate. Appreciate it, man. But no, I can allow that. We can allow Jillian Valentine a little nap. I'm cool with that. You rest up, Jillian. We love you. Hell yeah. Might take the flamethrower around with us. We can just have a laugh with it, can't we? We'll do that. Thank you, Hayden, for the follow. I appreciate you, man. Make another little Spando Ballet Gold as well. Come on. Get this combined up. Hell yeah. Um, no, it's not actually Let It Ride. Um, could not be played on PS1 emulator as far as I know. Um, so this is for the PC, this mod. Yes, yeah, so if you just go on buyarand.net, 
Um, it's got everything you need. It's got the base game and, and the, the randomizer mod on there. I'll take that with us. Um, actually, I feel like I've got um, a missing spark shot. We'll take it with us. Yeah, bad to miss clown. <laughs> Can have a laugh with it. Oh, you know what? I, I will. I will get the flame throw. But we'll go get the spark shot if we uh, if we feel like it. That should be fine. Oh yeah. Thank you as well, Jordy, for the follow. Thank you guys. Oh yeah, the eliminators got you. Um, Steve said the eliminators in Ari Zero. They're the monkeys that jump all over the place. Yeah, yeah. They, they are hard to get a target on, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. I get you now, man. Thank you. Thanks for like clearing that up. Yeah, I do remember that. Oh no. Kind of Willy B patrolling round here. Hell no. Nah. Thank you, Blee, for the follow. Oh, whoa, whoa. That's what I mean. We're gonna light up your ass. Oh man, <laughs> it's like loads in here. That's, I th that's unless you're gonna take up all our flame throw, I think. Watch out, watch out for those, Kendo. They're gonna be going for your Tims. Hell no! Nah. Hell no! Nah. That's the thing with these, you gotta, the only thing with the flame throw, you gotta wait till the light proper up close. Yes, fuse case, come on. It is Jack, honestly. I, I think uh, Aria Zero is scary to play, for sure. It's definitely one that I'm not comfortable on. <laughs> you got to impersonate in her, AV. <laughs> Been playing Aria 2 Remake loads last week. Found myself running upstairs like Claire. <laughs> I love trying to be like my favourite Aria characters. I love it. I, I love her uh, just... Just vibing around my house, just pretend I'm Leon in the RPD hoodie, you know? Pedro, thank you for the follow. Always freaking love Leon Kennedy. Yeah, they're, they're wicked. The great Dark Spiral has said they're not too bad, these mods. They're, they're wicked, man. Can go in there now. What's going on, Jordan Rex? Welcome on in, mate. Always awesome to see ya. But yeah, you know you've been playing too much Resi. You'd be, uh, be vibing around like uh, like the characters, you know. Where's the other one? Do, do I really have to take the handgun? I want to see what the other thing is. That's it. I want to see that item. There we go. We're going to need that. Oh, these crows ain't loyal. Setting fire to the crows. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, I, was, I shit myself when we streamed Dino Crisis. I still need to um, go back and, and complete it. Because I think we've got kind of probably around halfway through the game. Um... Yeah, but we do need to go back. <laughs> we're open the tank plastic if Misty's going to be vibing with us. Misty, you've had way too much cowpaw. Look what it's done to you. Hold on. Uh... I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. Uh... 
Don't do that, just misty. Come on. Oh yeah, they'll be dropping our jam. Let's get the tank fast fix on the go. Seems our jam's just dropped. I've got a cherry tank fast stick. I'm going to combine it with a, a cola one as well. Does anyone else like to do that? Combine the the cheeky Haribo, you know, the tankastic flavours. Come on. How did a girl like you manage to survive? Excuse me. You're still wandering around. Ooh. Sorry about that, babe. We're moving to the clock tower area, which is the designated landing zone for the extraction chopper. But don't you worry, girly. You'll be safe in here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. They want you eliminated for reasons of their own. Fortunately, we can also use it as a moving shield to get us through the worst areas. Great! Ah! Ah! I thought you were one of them. Oh. Sorry about that. Finally, we have access to the elevator outside. <laughs> Not exactly. Although the conditions encountered on this operation were extreme, it was an unexpected outcome that the team would be wiped out. But you should be safe inside here. I'm keeping a close eye on things. Since I'll be the only one who knows what really happened, I'll have more bargaining power when it comes to discussing my bonus. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. I'll check over there. They want you eliminated for reasons of their own. Who are you? What are you doing here? She's not here anymore, Gendo. <laughs> Rose has gone flying. I thought you were one of them. I ain't got no clue, darling. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. He be getting rid of the G-Virus. It's actually really funny to see Kendo hit the ground like that. You know, because we never see Kendo rage in the OG game, do we? You know? What made her do that? Because she's Regina from Dino Crisis. She can do what the hell she wants. I love Regina. That's awesome to hear as well, Darks. Instead of working on my own mod. Hell yeah, man. I hope it goes well for you. Oh. Thank you for that right off the bat. Not the best this, you need the uh, grenade launcher. Oh shit! Get off me, get off. Shit, we're on danger as well. We got it. Didn't realize how many um, shots it'd take. Obviously, I never um, never go up against it with a shotgun. I always have the um, launcher ready or. Um, or the magnum or something, you know? Maybe Fuse will take that. 
can take that as well. There we go, lovely. No longer poisoned. Oh shit. You know we are, we've got, we got a little bit left. She was on you, you fucker. Get off! There we go. Thank you, Hayden Schindler. I appreciate you, man. And I'm with you on that, Amy. So don't be sweet, so I'll mix a strawberry and lime star best. That is a, that is a decent mix, strawberry and lime. Hell yeah. I love mixing, like, cherry and cola. Yeah, the cherry and cola uh, tang fastics. Hell yeah. If there's anything else you can really do with that. It's fine. It's fine. We've got our main things. That's right, Miss Clam. How about some roast crow to put on that full English? Come on. Go use that main fuse as well. What's going on, Albert and Farid? Great to see you guys. That was random. It never normally shows that view when you put on that main fuse. So, Kyra, this is a randomizer, this, mate. So, everything's uh, completely randomized. Yeah, still need that um, MO disc to escape with as well. So yeah, we are on the hunt for that. Has that done it? Nice. But yeah, we're on the final stretch, guys. We'll be uh, finishing up very soon on this. Damn crows. Gonna have to... Oh, actually. What's that? That's fine. So that's check that them with the MO disc. That's literally the, the last key item that we do need. Thank you for that, Liam. I appreciate you posting that. There it is. Okay. We need to sort out the inventory anyway, so we'll pop over here. Oh, shit! Nice. They're awful, those. They're, they're, um, they're called, like, chimeras. Chimeras from RE1. Horrible damn things. They'd be cray cray. Um, yeah, so we'll just nip through. Um, I don't know if we need that or not. Can use the back weapon box key as well. Um, put the... Uh, Flame throw away. Um, just in case any zombies, whatever in the way, I'll just take them with us. Um, yeah, we should be good. Just go see what's through here. Yeah, the zombie hands, the, the great, aren't the great little enemies? Let's go through. Yeah, I have to say, it's, it's been time since I played RE Zero, so I would like to go back and, and stream it sometime. A lot of requests for that. Whoa, 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 get off, get off. Oh, there's like loads of them. Shit. Thank you. 
Fuse that sort of distance away. There we go. So was the one row. There we go. I, th I thought we'd gone down. I thought we'd gone down. Jeez. Heal him up. Heal the man. <laughs> That's my bad. That is my bad. Actually, we could do with a, a Spando Bally, I think, for that, because we have got him poisoned as well. That'd be my bad. There we go. Lovely. Don't like seeing you in, in a bad way, Kendo. There we go. Let's go back into that lab. Hey, Holsby, awesome to see you. I'm doing good, thank you. I hope you're well. Thanks for stopping on in with us. We're just going to be closing up uh, on this stream fairly shortly as we complete the game. And then, uh, all being well, I should be back tonight with some Tomb Raider 2 in our evening stream. What's going on, Jane? Thanks for stopping in. Hope you're well as well. Uh, lovely, thank you. I wonder where the machine gun was. We haven't had that all game. Bloody hell. Should we go vibe with that? I can't even get in the door. There we go. Oh, sit down. Oh, sit down. Sit down next to me. Get off. Bish didn't even take me to Nando's. Get off. Y'all are going way too up close and personal. You done? Hell no. All this for some Tony's arms. It's fine. I'm going to go this way. He's chilling over there. So yeah, we're literally ready to go face the final boss now, guys. Just wanted to check in there. See if there's anything, but yeah, we good. What's going on, Paige? Thanks for stopping back in with us. Don't need to head into there, we are good. Right, so what we'll take, we'll take the, um, we, we did get a rocket launcher earlier in the game, so we'll grab that. Um, Got a boomstick. Um, obviously, put that back. I've got some grenade rounds as well. Oh, actually, I've got those. Out. I won't take that just because it, it is just the one stray bullet, so that's fine. Um, I think we should literally be fine with those. Um, even if I pop some of these back. Because uh, I obviously just need some. Uh... Let's have a look. One, two. That's good. Heal us up there. We'll use the Magnum first off. Um, yeah, we'll just make a save, guys. Then the MO disc is just in that other um, hallway. So we'll grab that, then go head to the final boss. Come on, we there. Awesome, we've we done good this randomizer. It's been good. We haven't actually had any deaths either. We've done real good. Get out. Poor Bobby Kendo, man. His Tims are going to be wrecked. <laughs> this one, I think it was. There we go. Well, thank you guys, everyone, for being here. Like I say, we're about to go on the final boss. I am multi-platform streaming, so I'm Holster TV over on YouTube and TikTok. Holster TV, mate, over on Twitch. Please feel free to follow on whatever platforms are good for yourselves. Uh, we're always working on uh, growing across the platform, so thank you, guys. Thank you for all the likes and shares of the live as well. Thanks for that. Oh, you found my little gadgets. Watch your step. Nice. Yeah, I'm doing good, thanks for asking, Billy. Um, 
I'm not sure if you get like a Aris Brooks said do you get a special bonus if you complete without saving um I think uh, it just helps towards your rank in the end I wouldn't say a particular bonus I don't think thank you Zad for pinning the comment I appreciate you thank you this is um this is the boss from the B scenario fucking hell in it oh no I think it is this one in it Confuse me. Yeah, it's, oh yeah, it's going into the uh, thingy one. I'm, I'm gonna use the grenade, the rocket launcher on it. Use the rocket on this one. I hate this one. It's like a. I have to make sure it's gonna stay on the floor next to us. Come on, drop down, drop down. Come on, drop down. There we go. Oh, right up your ass. Come on. Get off Bobby. Right on dirty caution as well. Hell no. Oh, shit. See what I mean? It's real annoying at, like, evading it, you know? I'll go with the grenade rounds in this one. There we go, come on! Thank you Irish Butt for dropping us all those roses mate, appreciate that. Thank you C1BJ2 as well for the follow. Hell yeah! been epic guys thanks so much for joining us we've done just over three hours uh, this morning hell no freaking spitters get out of the way bro, bro we out of here get out let's go with a shot toy. get out of here hell no imagine it doing you dirty on the final run through get off <laughs> still trying to injure bobby on his way out but yeah we have made it guys almost Get out of the way! <laughs> what? Don't you dare, not now. Not now. I'm sorry about this, Bobby. Oh my god, what? <laughs> right, we can finally celebrate now. Come on! Ooh. So obviously we've, we've got the, the standard uh, game ending to, to chill and uh, enjoy. Thank you, Christopher, for the diamonds, mate. God, the little chill. So this has been like the A scenario. It's a nice little chill ending. Hell yeah. Thank you for joining us, guys. For this Resident Evil breakfast stream today. The full English breakfast show. Hell yeah. I thought it'd be cool to do a little um, classic RE2 as always. Um, with a cheeky fire and randomizer, it's been good. We've been living in Bobby Kendo's world this morning and afternoon. Oh shit, why have I moved that away? Sorry, <laughs> I don't know why I even moved that away to be honest. I was, I was clearing up around the keyboard, moved the mic away from myself. <laughs> you know what? I, I, I love the endings um, in the OG. I'll tell you what, I, I didn't like. Um, 
I didn't like in, in the remake how abruptly it ended. It ends so abruptly. I was like, where's where's the ending? And he's like, that was the end. I was like, really? You know? But yeah, it's been good, man. It's been, um, like I say, it was a bit of a slow start of this bio rant. Um, cause it was a bit, bit brutal right off the bat. Um, didn't find a couple of key items. It was a little bit of a struggle. We had some real tense... Um, parts in this obviously i think definitely the nemi hallway that was the worst with all those nemis um flying around in there it was cray cray in there um but yeah guys i will be back this evening we've got our um cheeky ranking there we go let's see what we got in there Yeah, we, we got a rank C, but obviously uh, we've completed it in less than three hours, which is cool. Uh, but like you say, we've also, we did a lot of saves, and what we did, which also affects your rank, I believe. You know in the weapon storage where you can collect either the machine gun or the side pack? Obviously I got both, I'll always, obviously, uh, you need to really collect the machine gun just in case it does end up being a key item. And then obviously the side pack, it's always useful in BioRand, because you, you're going around and um, just picking up loads of random obviously stuff and everything um you just got the odd stray bullets here and there whatever um so yeah you you need a lot to pick up so i, th I think i'm sure that also affects the ranking uh, if i'm correct but yeah guys we are we are gonna uh, end the stream right here uh but yeah all being well i should be back online uh, this evening uh, thank you very much for everyone then um, who's still here with us i'll look to raid out over on twitch as well um we'll go and uh Let's have a look who we got who we got on um we have got who's playing um i think we'll go raid out uh matt rpd um he's real awesome guys he's um he's, he's a resident evil um streamer um but yeah he's also streaming uh tomb raider at the moment so yeah just go to show uh, matt rpd uh, some love right now um uh, so yeah i'm gonna go uh we'll go raid him out and then i'll be with you guys uh, in the chat very shortly so thank you uh, as well uh, to everyone across the platform especially everyone on um twitch as well thanks for stopping by and we're, we're just 10 followers away as well from hitting uh, our first uh, 1k uh, followers so yeah massive shout out for that raid and all the raiders who are still in uh, massively appreciate you all so thank you guys we're going to show uh, the love to um matt rpd and i will uh, join you in the chat uh, in a bit so thank you everyone on twitch and i'll see you in a bit thank you all right we dropped that raid for our matt um but yeah man it's that was, that was insane we had a big raid over on uh, twitch like over 100 viewers uh, so yeah we had a lot of people uh thank you devon uh, for dropping that in said love the stream i'm so glad you enjoyed it thank you um Amy said, quickest I've got is six hours. <laughs> yeah, we, we just play it like so so much, you know. Uh, I can usually get it in under three hours. Um, I think I could probably, I'd, I'd love to maybe do a cheeky speed run at some point. But yeah, it's uh, it's cray cray. <laughs> it's cray cray. Um, but thank you everyone uh, for all the diamonds and roses that you've dropped. I'll do a cheeky last rose jump because we did have some roses coming at the end as well. So thank you guys. But yeah, all being well, I should be back online tonight. It'll be around the usual time, around 8 to 9 p.m. Uh, UK time. Uh, we should be back um, with Tomb Raider 2. Uh, we'll hopefully, I'll try and close off Tomb Raider 2 tonight. So then we are, um, then we can move on to like a, a clean stream on the next one. Um, and then jump into Tomb Raider 3. We can, uh, obviously, well, once we get round to it anyway, we can, um, you know, go explore the mansion with the quad bike this time. And then just get, get an overall feel and vibe for um the third game then because like i say it's, it's been years since i played that as well uh, since i was a kid so yeah we'll, we'll go do that uh, so yeah thank you very much guys as always for your support and uh, i'll see you tonight if not i will see you uh, on a future stream thank you very much everyone for all your support i'll see you in a bit yeah i really am going that's it people on the tubes i really am going thank you we'll see you in a bit <laughs>